everybody loved him. Hundreds of people would be by the courthouse. And he, you know, put up his finger to the government and that's it. This man is dying and you still have him in solitary confinement. He was tied, his feet to the bed and his hands were tied to the bed. People want to question if my father was weak or tough. He had a severe kidney infection. He was sick. He didn't get to see a doctor. By the time he got off the bus, he was covered in blood. If there was ever a time to become a rat or something, it would have been then. No, instead he fought five trials. Eli has never had any conversation with my father. He lied about my son. Like, this is how sick they are. I defend my family. I think I do a pretty good job of defending my family. But other people defend my family also. I don't ask them to do it, but they do. Hi, everybody. How is everyone tonight? Uh, let me see who's here. Hi, 556 Media. Hi, Claudio, Carol, Rat Trap City, Cremel, Jeff Tilly, Victoria Young. Hi, Mike. Oh, look at this. You knew. Hi, Mike. Mike, thank you so much for the other night for bringing Sam on. That was great. We have to do it again. Okay, Mike? That was great. Hi, Jane. Jane said, hit that like button, please, and thank you. <laughs> Hi, Carol. Rat Trap City. Kathy. Carlos. How are you, Carlos? Rob D, the Endo and Vito. We push back is here. Hello. <laughs> um, I call hi Marla. Um, Rob D. Did I say that already? Joe Delamura. Medit. How are you, Medit? Hi, Steel City. Hi, Edward. Hi, John Epi. Susie, how are you, Susie? Uh, Mott Street, how are you? Tex West Texas Burrito, David Hunt, Marky Mark. Anthony, how are you? Uh, lots of bad content creators along with the trolls on YouTube, just facts. I What, what does that mean? I don't know. Hi, Eric. Hi, hello, Chicago Muscle. Hi, Montauk. Hi, Harry, Eric. I said, Jojo the Wild Man. How are you, Jojo? Hi, Johnny Sideburns. Hello, Jane. BK Skip. Hi, BK Skip. Everybody go check out BK Skip's channel. He takes you from... Brooklyn to Queens to Pennsylvania. Hello, Tales from the Snitch. How are you? Oh, Michael, thank you. Uh, uh, uh. Let's see. I think I said, hi, Craig. How are you? Hi, Brody. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Chicago Muscle, I said. Oh, here, H-V-A-C-O-T-J. Hello. Hello, devil. Hi, Holly, go lightly. And Susie says, hello, we push back. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Hello, Tommy. How are you, Tommy? Hi, Root Irish. JL, hi Angel, how you doing? I'm good, I hope you are too. Hello, Edward. Um, mm, mm, mm. Hi, Graves and Zip, hi, Bill Jordan. Okay, I think I said hello to everyone. 
Hi, Frankie Cicero. C Cicero? I'm sorry if I messed that up. Anthony says, hi, everybody. Always great people in Angel's chat. I think so. Hi, Arthur. Hi, Angel in the drama-free room. That's right. <laughs> Hello, Nicholas D. John Minucci. How are you, John Minucci? Hi, Claudio Soprano. I think I got everyone. Okay. If you hear that little tiny noise, that's my son. He's streaming. Okay. Hi. I want to say, I want to just talk about a few things and then I want to show you something. Um, last week I did a stream, right? And it was uh, called Shadow of My Father. It was um, the Rest in Peace Joe O'Kane. Uh, show. And I was addressing a man named Danny Trio, who was on with Lee Cole. I called him a window or windshield installer that no one remembered. That was because when I asked um, about him um, to someone who worked in my uh, cousin's shop, they didn't remember him. They didn't know him or remember him. And, but then when I sent the picture, I, uh, I didn't realize that that person that I asked worked for my cousin in 2000, the year 2000. So that was after Danny Trio left. Um, so Danny told the story about Johnny like getting knocked out by a man named Victor. That story is, I would say, about 95% true. Yesterday, I went straight to the horse and he remembered it and explained what happened. Uh, now, the only thing that Danny got wrong was when he said that my brother John was there when it happened. My brother was not there, but the fraud tough guy, a light did get a beating. <laughs> uh, and he wasn't, and there wasn't a damn thing that he could do about it. He got a beaten and he couldn't do nothing about it. So Danny, I apologize. This person also confirmed your best friend, Nikki, who died of cancer at a young age. Again, I apologize, and good luck with the new concept that you and Lee have. Now, Lefty Guns, I hope you don't mind, but I took a snippet from your show when you had Jeff Nadeau on. I hope you don't mind this. Jeff Nadeau said... I don't like him at all. I hate him. Those are his words. Um, so I just want to show you something. Um, and by the way, I believe that he called my father a psychotic killer on Lee Cole's show. And he actually asks why when he does a video on my family, I don't like him. Seriously. Now, just watch this. I think the problem on YouTube, like with a lot of these people is they think like if you say something, like for instance, this is a true story, Lefty. Angel Gotti, okay? She doesn't like me at all. She hates me. Because I do videos on her family that she doesn't agree with. I'm not talking about them personally. I don't have any issue with them. I, they, they, you know, they did what they did. That's fine. I have no, I don't personally dislike them. Why? Because I do a video that you don't agree with. You don't like me. Like, well, because I think, I think, and then listen, I'm, I honestly don't, I'm going to say this disclaimer. Yeah. I don't really know too much about this, but what I've grasped. But even in Jimmy, why would he dislike what you did? You just ask questions. You don't like, 
I, I don't think you have any vendetta. You just asked a question. Like, isn't that what this is about? It's, it's conversation between people. Right. But I think, you know, I think their problem with you is um, they feel maybe you're putting like an opinion out there like it's a fact. You know, well, here, here's the thing, Lefty, like the videos that I do um, are fact. I mean, I did a video recently on John Sr. They came out of his mouth, the words. I was analyzing the wiretaps like I didn't say it. He did like it, it's again, we have to understand if I can say this very openly, let, let's stop beating around the bush. Her brother sat down with the government. If it were anyone else. Everyone would call him a rat. It's that simple. We can sugarcoat it all we want, but I, you know, like, honestly, like I'm, I'm looking at it from I'm looking at it from a, a, a defendant's point of view. Like, yeah. all right, so he sat down. Like that is a um, that is basically a legal strategy. It's he not a legal strategy. Some fucking, listen, it is though. It is somebody giving. Listen, I I can I can fucking call somebody up right now, and they can tell you, hell yeah. I told police some fucking, I gave them fake names to get out on fucking bail. Dude, this kind of shit happens. It's not like somebody's, this guy, you know, gave him a 302 with old information in the hopes that maybe, you know, they'd be like, all right, fuck it. Hell yeah. Look, if he didn't have the last name Gotti, would you call him? Would you call him that? Because again, like. No, I do not. And that's the thing. That's the thing. Um, I, I. I don't get fucking, um, I'm not mesmerized or anything by any names or anything like that. I look at things objectively sure. and it's like, you know, if he sat down and they were able to use any of that 302 information or it was any information that they weren't aware of, you know, then yeah, you know, but there was no. Is Francis an informant to you? Yes. He, he did put, the same he, thing as Cuddy. No, he put he put what's his face away. That fucking well, Junior Joe named Watt. Daniel Marino in his testimony. He named Joe Watts in his. Like, well, there wasn't testimony. It was a three hundred two that they weren't able. Why to was he even? What Joe his, Watts was. Let me ask you. What would his father say about that? You think he would be happy with it? No, but you know, you saw how his father said. His father said, man, look, if I took a fucking steeple from the church and I yeah. had it sticking out of my back pocket, yeah. I'd still fucking say I didn't take it, yeah. you know? So yeah. I like you, man. You're you're all right, guy, either way. You, at least you have conversations. You don't just run the, you know. No, man, I, I'm always for having a, a conversation or a debate, you know. I I, I – I, I enjoy having hey, look at these people in your chat. I, I'm trying to get you like we're having conversations, man. What are you talking about, man? Yeah, these people are these people are so quick to like just this is why I don't come in these shits, man. But I like you. I like I like talking to you. You're a nice guy. So oh, thanks, man. But look, man, you that's the thing, man. Don't get caught up. Like a lot of these people, like I notice that come on shows and shit, they'll be looking at the chat and they'll get caught up and like no, nah, but man, these people, some of these folks have certain, I don't have no agendas in nobody. Like I just tell, I try to tell a story and some people don't like it, I guess, but. It yeah. But uh, you keep doing your thing, my man. All, All right. right. Thanks for coming on, Jeff. Cheers, bro. Now, Nate, dude, that's funny. Considering a bunch of anonymous people in the chat triggered you simply for giving their opinions. <laughs> now, you said my brother added. Now, that's interesting considering our private Twitter messages where you said you and Scott Bernstein did a podcast saying that was not true. Now. Of course, I have receipts. And let me show them to you. Here, August 20th. You called my brother a rat last night, you little weasel? No, I didn't. We talked about it and both agreed he wasn't. We are in the business of talking about mob history. We both agreed docs, all the docs were fake or something like that. Then, hold on. Then, the docs, all that 
wherever YouTube. I'm not going to say it. Crap is childish. A lights are a holes. Other folks are wrong as well. I don't understand any of it. Doesn't take away from the fact that I want to talk about. One of the reasons I no longer are a part of any of those shows, I dipped my toes in for a few weeks and I'm now done with that. Hmm. You're welcome to go back and listen what I said. I didn't one time say anything to the kind. In fact, I said, the government had a vendetta against the Gaudis. The government had a vendetta against the Gaudis. Okay? That's Jeff Nadeau, what he said. Hmm. Now, this is the interesting part. On or about November 23rd, you were on Fat Bull Sicilian Show talking badly about the defendant in my lawsuit when you received an Instagram message from an account called Fat Angel, The Whale, whatever it was. Uh, you showed us all, you showed us all that. You put it up to the screen. Right after you spoke not so nicely about the defendant, you received that message. You remember that? You remember it, right, Nidu? I messaged you and asked you for it, and you gave it to me. There's a part in my lawsuit where that's included. After that, you did a story about my dad, I told you that the story wasn't true. You told me you got it straight from a CO on the internet. I told you that first the CO didn't even know the warden's name and that there was even an, an inmate that was on YouTube who said that that story you did wasn't true. You told me, Angel, just because you don't want it to be true, doesn't mean it's not true. Then you blocked me. So I couldn't continue the conversation with you. Now you're doing negative shows on my brother again. And despite his attorney at the time, Jeff Lickman, explaining it all on YouTube and my brother's own words and Dominic Sicali's testimony, you're going back with the lies? What happened? Jeff, I have a very good feeling I know what happened and you just might be getting yourself involved in something. So we shall see, Nadeau. Now I wanna say something else before I forget. Common sense, if you're here, I didn't uh, check to see, I see there's a lot of comments right now. Um, I should have asked you if you wanted to come on the other night when I had, um, the basketball player, Sam, on. So I just want to tell common sense. You have an open invite to come on whenever. And I mean whenever you want. Just say, drop the link. Now I want to talk about We Push Back. Everyone knows I had my issues with it. Again, I emphasize my those were my issues. What everyone else did was none of my business. We all have an opinion of what we push back is. To me, it's mutts like a light, Panisi, the rest, etc. They come on social media and lie. The evil rear ends off. They taunt family members of the men they testified against. They are despicable lowlives. They lie. They threaten women and the children of the men they testified against. They harass the women and they harass the children. Now, the other night, I told everyone how my little channel here has an opportunity 
because of my crazy cousin to go big. Um, with just a few little changes and I will do it. And I am going to take, we push back with me. I will bring public awareness to we push back because I'm not going to allow punks like a light and company to get away with what they are doing any longer. Now, how's that? How's that everyone? Oh, what happened to my little thing? Oh, what happened to it? Here it is. So what do you think about that? Now, let me say hello. And anybody want to ask me anything about that? Uh, Anthony, Angel, does that make John A. Light about 24, 26 years of age when he got that beaten? Some might call that his prime. And when he took that beating, you're going to have to ex Danny uh, when he's on Lee's show. You're going to have to ex Danny because I didn't ask that question. But you can ex uh, Danny. Uh, Claudio says, for the love of God almighty, subscribe to Angel Gotti and hit that like button. Just saying. Good, th good thoughts to all. Thank you, Claudio. Uh, imagine getting beat up by a woman. Oh, uh, I don't know what that means. Tim, Jeffany, do and Lee. No, we're making some. No, that's not true. That's not true at all. Absolutely not. <sighs> Every Jersey girl says everyone hit the like and subscribe. Okay. I'm, I went, I'm trying to look. I think I went a little bit too far back. Uh, Ma Bratz one, Jeff Nadeau doesn't know as much as he claims he makes up. He makes a lot up or he will get it off some flyby website. Yep. I agree. Hi, Angela. How are you, Angela? Uh, I think this. <laughs> uh, Andy Griffin. Oh, you heard him. Yep, Andy Griffin. He's on. Griffith. Uh, Nadu has an agenda buying subs. Nadu has an agenda, all right. I have a feeling I know what it is. Hi, Boston. Red. Hold on. Hi, Danny. How are you, Danny? Dante's farm. The government had a vendetta against the Gambino family, and your father inherited the fallout. I don't know what to say about that. I really don't. I know they had, after that, they had a vendetta for a few people. Hi, Minnie the Moocha. Hi, TT Rad. Yes, Chicago Muscle. <laughs> You're right. Uh, left lane posse. He blocked a woman. I don't know what, what does that mean? Oh, yes. Okay. <laughs> yes. He blocked me. So I couldn't continue the conversation with him. He blocked me. Yes, Angela. Mob Rats one, he has no facts, none, no facts. Exactly. Hello, Westies. How are you? Uh, 
That guy made my blood boil talking about burning their food on purpose. I wanted to jump through the screen. Uh, uh, do you want to come on, Chris? Let me know, Team Angel. You just brought tears to my eyes. <laughs> Let me know if you want to come on. <laughs> uh, Josie would knock Jeff the F out. What happened with Josie and Jeff? <laughs> um, did I miss something with Josie and Jeff? Josie would knock the Jeff the F out. Okay. Thank you, Angela. Yes. Hashtag Team Angel. That's right. Thank you. Great golfer. Common sense. That's right. Anytime. He has an open invitation. Uh, oh, thank you, everybody. Hashtag Team Angel. Aw, oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Craig. The Cuddies is stand-up people love the Artuzos. Oh, do you know them? Do you know them? <sighs> oh, that's Minnie the Moocha. Oh, wait, let me get Marla. No scam, do your videos are not fact. That's right, they're not. Tim, hi, Angel. I'm going to text you privately about one of your mods blocking my main account just now. Um, do you text me? You have my phone number? Do you have my phone number? Hello, Yankees for life. How are you? Uh, this one mod is sabotaging your friends and show. Who would that be? Because, see, my friend Angela um, is a dear friend, and she's in the chat. And if anybody is blocking anybody, Angela can see who it is. And she would have texted me and told me, but I haven't gotten that text yet. See, moderators can see which moderators are blocking people. John Minucci, hello, Angela and Cass. Team Angel, thank you. <laughs> uh, I don't know how you're going to send screenshots. To, I don't know how you have my phone number. I don't know who you are. <laughs> but Angela still hasn't texted me, so I don't think anybody's getting blocked. Hello, Maddie. How are you? Yes, everybody, please. If you're on Facebook, Carlos dropped the link for the Justice for Alan Kaiser Facebook. Please, just, just show it a little support, please. Show it some support. Okay. Hello, Chris Casparosa. Hello, Minuch. Team Angel, thank you. John Aletto is a killer. Oh, um, not really, but um, Angel, thank you, Montauk. Maddie, we push back. Go big. Yep. Jason, yeah, your cousin was great. Yeah, he is. He's great. He's funny. Um, Go Angel, yes. Yes, I have to make a few changes. They don't want me to to um, have an avatar. They want me to, um, um, you know, show myself. And we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I have to meet with her. So either she's going to come here or I'm going to go to Florida. Eric Oaks, that's amazing. Thank you. Love it, Angel. Thank you, Steel City. Mike, hi, hi, Mike. How are you? Thank you, Bill Jordan. 
Thank you, Rat Trap City. Claudio Soprano, we push back. We push back is we push back. <laughs> um, thank you, Carol. Agree with you. Thank you, Edward. Carlos, do that thing, Angel. Thank you, Carlos. Uh, Anthony A. Light was 34, 35 years old when that beating happened. I don't think so. I don't think he was that old. But ex Danny. Uh, it, Graves and is your brother going to be involved? No, this is just mine. My brother has his own things going. He's got three different projects in the works and he is way, way busy. Thank you, Angela. And Claudio says, hit that like button, just saying. Okay, yay, Team Angel. Thank you, Lori Love. We push back, Maddie, thank you, yes. Uh, Tommy Guns, thank you. You rock, Angel. God bless you and your family. Thank you. Uh, Craig, anybody in New York from New York City to Niagara Falls knows that didn't happen. Yeah, well, um, um, yeah, exactly. But, you know, like some people, like I said before, have an agenda. So, but we'll find out what the agenda is. Tim, oh, hi, Angel. The email was sent about the problematic mod. <laughs> Where did you send the email to? You know, <laughs> now you have my email address. I don't know if anybody has my email address. I don't put my email address out there. My brats won. We push back thousand percent all the way. It's time everyone find out about these lying rats. Exactly. Oh, hold on one second. Hold on.
I'm sorry, everyone. I know there was no sound. It's because one of my uh, my um, attorneys just called me. I'm sorry. Hold on. I'm going to drop a link. Just in case he wants to come on, I'm dropping the link for him. And okay. So the link is there in case he wants to come on. I'm sorry. Let me get back to what, uh, let me see. Where was I? I'm so sorry. I was going to put a video on and, uh, um, <laughs> I was going to put a video on and then I forgot to press the button. Okay. So. Let me get back to the chat. I'm so sorry. Uh, let me get back. Uh, Marky Mark made dues a spoiled little watered down from the burbs. Another groupie fanboy, basically. Well, he's not a fanboy of my family. He called my father a psychotic killer. Hmm. Uh, okay. Hi, U.S. Army combat medic. A bit late. Had to take my little girl to the vet to get a small piece of plastic out of her eye. Oh, my God. She's okay now. All right, good. I remember my niece, Lewis's niece, um, when she was young, gripped a coat down from the closet and the wire hanger went right into her eye. Oh, my God. That was such a nightmare. But she was okay. I hope everything is good with your daughter, Army Medic. Mike, I listened to John Jr. on YouTube earlier from a while back. Very intelligent man. Well spoken. Yes, he is. Thank you. He is very well spoken. Steel City, Nadu just goes off Wikipedia. I don't know where he goes off of. I really don't. But you tell him something's not true, and you're gonna you know you you try to explain something to him, and he's just like just nah, 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 and then blocks you. That's him. That's what he reminds me of. Nah, 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 nah. Maddie says, glad she is okay, combat medic. Yes. Um, Jeff Nadu obviously wants an interview with, yep, that's probably it. Or oh, no, it might be a little bit more. TT Rad, Angel, I wish you all the best with the expansion of your YouTube channel. Thank you very much, TT. Thank you. Hi, Cousin Paulie. Hi, Angel. Hopefully you and your family are doing well. Yes, we are. Thank you. I hope you are too. Chris Casparosa, I will call you later, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Jane, Team Angel. Thank you, Jane. Uh, Joe Cool and they do refuses to test to believe, but Joe testified. It's all oh, I don't even know what that's about. I have no idea what any of that even means. Uh, Perry. Hi, Cousin Paulie. Hello, Angel. I hope you had a great Easter yesterday. Yes. Um, I just had a very quiet day with my daughter. I made her a lasagna, and it was very good. She loved it, and we just had a very quiet day. Um, my daughter's not ready to celebrate the holidays yet, you know, because her father died, so... And she just wanted to stay home and I wasn't going to leave her home alone. So I decided to stay home with her and we had a nice day. We really did. 
And thank you. I hope you had a good Easter too. I hope everybody had a good Easter. I hope you all did. Jojo, the wild man, team angel, team MRE. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Angel, you know, we all love you. Uh, thank you so much, Sean. Ah, uh, thank you. Met it. Look at that dude named dude who will take him serious. He is a clown. Not me. Craig Benson. Phyllis is my godmother. Which Phyllis? I know three Phyllises. Which one? Uh, Tim says, press one. No, don't press anything. <laughs> um. Claudio, people in the land of the living, subscribe to Angel and hit that like button just saying yes. Okay. Angela is a great mod. It's one of the others. You're not understanding what I said, but I don't know why you are um, fixated on this, but no one is blocking anyone in the chat. No one. Dante's Farm, don't forget to pay the real mafia. That's right. They had taxes today. That's right. It's tax day. <laughs> okay. Hi, Finn Freak. Where's my ice cream? I don't know what that means. Uh, baked beans. Angel, how's your sister Victoria? What is she doing these days? She's pretty busy. She's you know, she's still uh, working, um, and she has two beautiful grandsons, so she keeps herself very busy. Jersey girl, hope everyone had a great Easter Passover. That's right. That's right. Happy Passover. Uh, 556, five, Angel, Mrs. Smith says hi. Hi, Mrs. Smith. How are you? Uh, An Angela, best thing about your show is now people know the truth and can call out the liars like they do. Exactly. And A-Light and the rest of them. Panisi, the rest of them. Uh, Chicago Mud. Angela saw no blocks. There are, there are no blocks. Chicky, I'm dropping the link, Chicky. Come on. I'm dropping the link for you. Come on. Because I think that my uh, friend and attorney got lost. <laughs> um, Holly, go lightly. Yay, come to Florida. Yeah, I am. I have to. Uh, I have to. Finn Freak, are we ready for this coming Nor'easter? What coming Nor'easter? What are you talking about? Uh, where do you live, from, Finn Freak? What's a Nor'easter? Oh, like when? Tales from the Snitch. Yes, I did. Whisperate. Oh, look, everybody's saying hi to Chicky. TT Rad. Jane, oh, Jane, you're in Florida, too. Yes. I know. Hey, Angela. Hey, Chicky. Chicky. Let's see. You hit Andy Griffin? Okay. Holly, go lightly. Move to Florida. Moved here from L.A., need a friend. Uh, what part of Florida? Tell me. I have my whole, a lot of my family is in Florida. So tell me what, what, what part you're in. Hi, Gianni. How are you? And uh, Holly, are you single? Um... Uh, Tim, I'm not reading your things anymore because uh, they're, they're, uh, nobody is blocking you or timing you out. Bring Angel. 
Yeah, see, Jane wants to know what part you're in also. What part of Florida? Uh, my daughter, my dog is making a lot of noise. Uh, Rat Trap City. I loaded the next Ravenite transcript today. Oh, I have to go check that out. I have to try... Um, uh, check that out, Rat Trap City. By the way, Angel, how's our kitty? Um, the one that's here, I don't know. I'm still going back and forth with he. To me, he just doesn't look like he's very um, happy. And the one, the new one that comes by, comes by and is still eating. So I don't know. I guess I don't know what to do. Florida attorney. Angel, if you come to Florida, I'll take you to Joey's favorite place, steak place in Boca. Okay. Thank you. Hi, Angel. Yes, I did. Pull strings, pull strings for Angel. It's all because of me. Yes, I did. <laughs> Are you the one who's blocking people, Carlos? Uh, thank you for answering my question, Angel. You seriously are the sweetest person on YouTube. Ah, oh, thank you very much. But um, see that if that is, if it is you, Carlos, then my friend Angela is just no rat. Uh, Hi, Angel. Give them hell. Don't let them breathe. Good luck with your new venture, Team Angel. Oh, Team Angel. Yay. Thank you, John. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Oh, I can't. Hi, what's real? Hi, Teresa Murphy. How are you, Teresa? Hi, what's real? Uh, no, you had sound. Um, Holly Go Lightly saw that Eli interview, wanted to throw up. No, see, I, I didn't get upset. Everybody else got upset. All my friends in my chat got upset, but not me. I didn't get upset. He's a pathological liar. There are two websites about him. Um, so... I don't get upset by him at all. Uh, Jane, jumping in the shower. Don't talk about anything interesting for 10 minutes. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm far behind. Angel said, hold on. Yes. Uh, Chicky, all the real ones in the chat as usual. Salute. Yep, that's right. Uh, Jojo, the wild man, rats like swimming in the sewer water near Sugar Daddy's Club. Yeah, that's right. Uh, Uh, yeah, I know. Some people think that I would. Yeah, see, I, I, I'm i sorry. I said to hold on. I'm far behind. Let me catch up. Okay. Okay, I'm trying to catch up a little bit, so I'm going down fast. Oh, hi, Nitro. Is Nitro here? Back. Shout out to No Fly Zone for putting eye light in his place. Love to see Carlos shoot the fair one with that insect. I um I don't know. Did they have him on their show? I must I missed it. Jersey girl, oh no, I'm very sorry to hear that. We'll continue healing prayers for mama, my little one. Oh, no, don't tell me anything bad about cats, any animals. Don't tell me anything bad. I don't want to know. 
Angela, FYI, please don't take it personal. I don't say hello back. Sometimes I'm listening, but doing other stuff. Yes, I know. I do that all the time. I'll say hello, and then I'll start doing what I have to do. Yes, I know. Uh, Susie, I gave shout out on Instagram yesterday about Angel and all of us who are supporting We Push Back. Thank you, Susie. Thank you very much. I, I, I haven't been on Instagram. Uh, let's see. Uh, what's this? Nadu has a five head? What does that mean? Angel, did you have a good Easter? Took my dad out for dinner. Mine is Sunday. Oh, so you're Greek. That's right. So Greek Easter is this Sunday. That's right. Um, good. I hope you have a great time. And happy Greek Easter. Happy Easter to you. I know Kasparosa is uh, is half Greek. And his is Sunday. Uh Left lane, he had to have lost a bet to wear a haircut like that. Oh, you're talking about Nadu? Nadu has tunnel vision when it comes to your family history. He should be ashamed of himself. Yeah, he should be, but he's not. Um, Holly Golightly, I'm so excited for your new channel. It will be amazing. Thank you very much. Hello, Angela. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. No fly. Oh yeah, no fly zone is on also. Oh, I'm not not sure if this is really you or not, but hey, Angel, much love. Thank you, Danny Trio. I'm not sure if it's you or not, but good luck, Danny. Tim, I don't know what you're doing in here by bringing this guy up. Um, I'm not sure what your motive is here, but I don't want... Um, Anybody commenting or saying anything about this? I have a lawsuit. So you're bringing him up, and I don't understand why. Don't bring him up in here because nobody's going to talk about him to you. I understand this is my first Greek Easter this Sunday. I'm going to be away without... Oh, you're going to be with the... Oh, without your mom. I'm sorry, Perry. I'm so sorry. Um, Claudio, people sub to MRE and JTP. Yes, please. MRE, Mob Rats Exposed, and Justice Tech Pros. You could drop their links, please. Hi, Real Bofa. How are you? Angel, much love. Thank you. Thank you, Bofa. Oh, oh, okay. I'm sorry. All right, Craig. I understand. Okay. Joel Cool, you you missed my first comment. It was about Nadu videos that were wrong. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Uh, let's see. Hi, Eyeball Patch. How are you? Nadu reminds me of like a Dr. Evil Bond villain that got phone. What happened to Chicky? Where are you, Chicky? What happened to Chicky and Casparosa? Claudio Perry, people stay away far from content creators who are toxic and evil. I did just saying, yes, I know you did, Claudio. You came back 
and you're here, and I appreciate that, and I'm so happy you came back, and thank you. Angela, John Jr., class act, that's right, he is, Angela, thank you. You hear, did you hear when Go McPyle came on? Holly, go lightly. Chicky, will you marry me? Chicky, where are you? You have a marriage proposal. <laughs> Lori, love. If Jane is in Florida, I'm coming, baby. Yep. Holly, go lightly. You single? Angel, I love the background soundtrack. Thank you. Oh, you mean the music? I see, I see. I'm sitting here going, what's he talking about? Here we go. Hold on, hold on. Oh, I'm so excited. Hold on. Hello, Chicky. Hi, Angel. How are you? <laughs> Stop the presses. A marriage proposal. You haven't met. Oh, Stop she, the presses. You, would, you didn't jump on when I said, Chicky, come yes, on. Yes, I did, no, but I just got, got a little. Yeah, once you got a marriage proposal, then you jumped on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, another Seriously. great chat. All the, people are in the, all the people are in the chat. The best people in the world. Yes, they are. But wait, where was your marriage proposal again? I don't know. I don't know where How, they went. Wasn't it Holly Golightly? Yes, there you go. Well, yeah, it was Holly Golightly. Holly Golightly. Holly, you want to come on and you can speak to Chicky? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can fix you up. I can fix you up. <laughs> Oh, she's in Boca. Oh, oh that's okay. Yeah. I like Boca. Yeah, I love Boca. You just have to wait about a six to eight months to a year for me to get down there. <laughs> but other than that, it's good. Well, at least you'll have like a um a, a writer pal pen. Yeah, pen. you have a writing pal. <laughs> uh, Holly, you interested? I mean, we did propose. Don't you want to know each other first? Yeah, exactly. Let me see where Holly is. Can you see the? Can you see the comments down at the bottom? Yeah, I can see. Well, I can see. Uh, I can see the one that's on your screen. Yeah. Oh no! Go to look at the comments in the chat. Oh, okay, hold on. Let me go to the chat. You remember how to do that? Yeah. Comments. Okay. Here we go. Angel, who's single? Chicky, single. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah, chicken. Angel coming to Boca. Okay, I'm there. Who? Who? Must mean you. Who's coming to Boca? Holly Golightly says, yeah, Chicky, and Angel Angel come to Boca. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> Holly Golightly, we got, come on the screen. Here, I'm going to drop the link. Come on. Let, let's get you and Chicky talking. Yeah, come right on. No, don't be shy. Come right on. We'll talk. Don't be shy. Come on, Holly. I dropped the link for you. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay. Oh, God. I got this cat I took in about a year ago, and she's great, but she keeps bringing me flying squirrels. What is fl What are flying squirrels? Hey, Common Sense. What's up, buddy? How are you? Common Sense is in checking in. Okay. Common Sense, did you hear what I said about you before? Did he hear? I don't know if he was here. He okay. says he's still at work. He's still at work, but he's oh, going to okay. watch it when he comes late, comes back. Okay. Oh, okay. I was just letting you know, Common Sense, that I should have let you on the other night when uh, the basketball player Sam was on. And That was a good show, right? That was good. What, yeah, a that was what a nice, what a gentleman he was. What, right? What a surprise. What a surprise that was. He would be a good guy to have on for like a whole hour. You know, we just talk about the old days and, you know, everything, just everything, you know, where he had like somewhere where he's just quiet at his house, you know? Yeah. So maybe uh, um, Mike sent me his phone number. So I have Sam's phone number. Oh, good. You should definitely yeah. set that up where it's an interview, you know? 
yeah, so then you'll come on and you'll Absolutely. ask him all these questions because I don't know anything really about basketball. Right, right. No, it'd be a pleasure. He was a real, yeah. real gentleman. He was a gentleman. I really liked like talking to him. Hi, Ray Mundy. I really did like it. Yeah, I mean, like I said, if it was a if it was a different circumstance, not you know where he was, it would have been it was good already. Never mind, it would have been better. Yeah, exactly. Um, I think Tim was just trying to start trouble. Really, you know what? Yeah, he was. He was trying to start trouble. He was bringing up things he shouldn't have been bringing up, and then uh, saying that he was getting blocked. And Carol said, Angel, none of us blocked anyone. His posts are still showing his posts. Yeah, exactly. So what's going on, Chicky? Hi, Michael Hensley. Hey, look at some of the some of the uh some of the chats are saying a, a mob two wedding, a mob two wedding. <laughs> <laughs> Holly. Hey, Where we could are do you, it. Holly? We could do it live on your show, Angel. <laughs> oh my God! Oh wait, look who else is here. <laughs> hey, Where are you, Holly? We could do it. Hello. Who's here? Who's here? Look who it is. Say hello. I'm we... waiting for Chicky to guess who it is. <laughs> Chicky, where did Chicky go? Wait, hold on. He must have got kicked off. Or maybe he got nervous. <laughs> <laughs> what? I, I, well, I, don't, I don't know what he would have got nervous about. I just I just tuned in now and I and I saw that. Because uh, he got a marriage proposal. Oh, here he is. He's back. Chicky has women for days. Hey, don't even know. Yeah. <laughs> How are you? I, what's up? I got a marriage proposal tonight. Another one? Don't be jealous. There could be a real one. She's in Boca. <laughs> is she in Do Boca Vista? Is that I told her she might have to wait like eight months, eight to ten or twelve months before I can come down. She, but she, I she may not be a hell of a, dude, a pen dude, pal. Dude, you better get to rewrite the will now. She may not be alive by then. <laughs> That's not nice. Holly no. Knightley is a very right. What's nice not nice? Woman? Oh, I'm, I'm not saying. Believe me, I, I'll be. I'll, it'll be such. A, I'll be a perfect gentleman. I mean, what, Chicky, Chicky is a master of kicking game to senior citizens. So, <laughs> of one, <laughs> Chris, what is wrong with you? I I'm know. Just speaking the truth. What, what can I say? Chicky is always women. You know me, Chris. You got to admit, I am a perfect gentleman. You got to admit that. I'm not one of these guys that run around crazy. You know that. No, any woman would be lucky to have you. Oh, thank you. Well, I don't know about any woman, but most women. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, that, that's not nice. No, not, I thought it was a compliment. What are you talking about? He's got a lot of women. No, I don't believe me. I'm not one of them kind of guys. I've never been. Uh, thank you, Danny. Um, Chris, Chris, where were you? What were you? Why you? What were you doing? That you're late. I just turned on the computer. Well, yeah. I know I was here for like 30 seconds in the beginning, and I typed in Team Angel. Hashtag Team Angel, and, and, then, right and then and then other people put it on too. But I don't know if Angel actually saw it. But then I just turned on the computer now, and I got the notification. Oh, Angel's on with, and it said Chicky's on. And I was like, "You missed a hell of a night the other night. I think it was uh, the night before Easter. Uh, we were up late, and we had a she had a great interview with a guy from a uh, great basketball player, played for the Philadelphia 76ers. What a gentleman! Yeah, she told me. She told me really, really good interview. Yes, yeah, Sam. Sam. What yes, was his yes. What was his fancy name? It was a great name. The oh, the the Haitian oh. sensation. The Haitian sensation. <laughs> yes, with no Haitian, discrimination. With no discrimination. <laughs> Number one in the nation. Yeah, that's what he said. <laughs> <laughs> that's what he said. He really was a nice man. Yeah, really, he was a really nice man. Yeah, oh, that really was Danny Trio. Because this Danny Trejo says so. Danny Trejo's an actor from Heat and a bunch of other movies. Yeah, that's what I thought. He, that's who was on the phone. That's the guy with all the tattoos. He plays great parts. Well, yes, you know, I, you know the story is the, the tattoo on his chest of like of like a woman that the whole huge like chest. Story yeah, yeah. Piece, right. I I saw him in interviews talking about that, and he got that when he was in prison, right? Right. But I, it was either him or the tattoo artist got transferred to another prison when and the tattoo wasn't done yet. Yeah. But then they finished it later on when they met up again, like in another prison, like the second half of it. Right. <laughs> he was walking around the yard with half a tattoo on his chest. But he was in the movie Heat. Remember, he played in Heat. Uh, Heat. 
Yeah, yeah. And and the story of how he got into the movies, he was a technical advisor on a different movie, um, I believe by the same director, by Michael Mann. Right. And um, and there's another, I could be remembering this wrong, but there's a famous writer. He was a convict in California. I got him, Eddie Bunker. He was in Reservoir Dogs. He was one of the guys in the beginning at the table in the suits, like mm-hmm. one of the like the, the armed robbers, right in the Tarantino movie. Yeah, he was. He, he wrote a bunch of books. He was like a famous like criminal, not like a prolific, high level criminal, but you know like a knock around guy, armed robber, that kind of stuff in California. Was in and out of prison for decades, but he started. He became an author in prison, and he wrote a bunch of books. And some of his books about prison life, uh, I know at least one of them got made into a movie, a book called Animal Factory with uh willem dafoe but you know he wrote some famous books about prison life and street life in california and he was in jail in prison with danny trejo and if i i could be remembering this wrong but i think it was him or somebody else that had been in the can with him that brought him as like a, like a technical advisor of sorts to the set of one of these movies and uh the director just saw him and like do you want to be in the movie they just put him in because he looked like he would fit one of the roles and that started his acting career yeah imagine that yeah, that's how it happens sometimes. Yeah, and he, you know, he had a he guys had a brilliant career. Talk about a second, second, second. Uh, what's the word? A second life, you know. So. Yeah, Willie. That that that's what could happen to me. Maybe with Willie Pep, in the movie. Oh, that, <laughs> no, that that the few. Hey, as, as, yeah, right. No, I, 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 well, as I put in the letter to the judge, I, I believe you know that you yeah. have everything. The stars are aligned for you to have. A uh, what's what's the word like a second uh, a second act, you know? Yeah, a when, second when, like a, a second a second, uh, a second a chapter a new book a new chapter. Yeah, I I, I believe it, you know. So because I know there's people waiting to put you to cast you in things, and uh, I've seen her acting firsthand. And I think you're a great actor, and I, I don't say that lightly. I think you're a natural, and you know, hopefully you act good in front of the judge, and she gives you a lesser sentence. <laughs> and and you know, listen, I. Thursday, Thursday, Thursday at two o'clock in Boston. So I thought it was Friday. <laughs> I thought it was Friday. Chris, they already Thursday. told you five times it was changed to Thursday. Thursday, yeah, they told Thursday at two o'clock in Boston. Yeah, the one or two. I think one, one or two, definitely. You said one, one o'clock, two. Chicky. Yeah, one o'clock. That's what it is. Yeah. It'll be on the thing, Chris. You know the memorandum thing. You look, you look at the computer. I, right I, I, look, I look before. It wasn't on there. Yeah, yeah but you know what? It, it, it ain't too. It ain't right too away. Skype. It's live. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's not too Skype. It's live. Okay. Wait. Let me just say, JoJo the Wildman, Amy Angel, Vinny Paz, who you know and interviewed, grew up next town to me. Great guy. Yep, yeah. Right in Rhode Island. Yep, great yeah. Great guy. His father, Angelo, was quite the character. After watching the first Rocky movie, we all wanted to box. He <laughs> yes, he did. That was a great, I have to say, that was one of one of the best that I've done because he, I was such a nervous wreck and he was the best. He was so good. He just took off. He took over. Right? right? He took over. You know who's uh, you know who's very close to that family, Angel, and uh, the father especially is the guy who uh, 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 is the owner of CES uh, for your nephew uh, fighting uh, Jimmy Birchfield. What what was that? Some music it, in the background. I don't it know was that. like a commercial that came up and something I was looking at on the computer. Oh, uh, so he wasn't even paying attention to us. No, too. he does what he does. He just always, comes in and does his own thing. Always has well, to do uh, something. Well. I, I, I was reading this thing. It said on ABC News, mom stabbed to death, dumped in duffel bag, suspect at large. Yeah, I saw and that. So I, 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 you know what? I was right by it. What, what city? Or what, where, in, where? Queens, in Queens, in Forest oh, Park. Oh, Jesus Christ. Forest Park, it's like central, like a mini central park, but like in Queens. And, uh, well, they found a body over there, a woman's body. Is that, no, is that near you, Chris? Or that's, where is that near? Forest Park is in central Queens. Oh, okay, and, or I think it's West Queens. It's considered actually, and it's uh, it's near like the Queens Brooklyn border. Oh, okay. Uh Chicago Muscle said, "Chicky Boogie." <laughs> Please, hold on, let me get to the, what did he say? Chicky what? Chicky Boogie. When you when when I was bringing someone on, you didn't know it was Chris, and you took off. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, Boston Red says Angel of Five Head is someone who has more than a forehead. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's good. That's weird. <laughs> Angela says sugar daddies. <laughs> 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 uh Chicago Muscle said, Wow, Chicky, get in there, bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Mott Street said, Good things on the horizon for your show. Well deserved, Angel. Thank you Absolutely. very much. Oh, look at this. Holly, I'll drop the link. You're oh welcome. boy. Come on and talk to Chicky. Holly, okay. Oh, is this, is Holly. this the one from the Boca Vista? This what this she's from Boca. Boca. Yeah. Obviously, you guys don't know what Del Boca Vista is. No. Where is it? Well, what is yeah. it? <laughs> we gotta beg you for the answer, Chris. What? We gotta beg you for the answer. What is it? what is it? Well, at one, time, totally at one time, Cosmo Primo was the president of the country. Oh, yeah, I remember. I remember when his parents, the parents' <laughs> place, remember? I mean, uh, Jerry's parents' place. That was hilarious. Are you telling me there's not one opening? Remember home? they threw them out? Boca remember Vista? they threw them out? They all threw the whole family out, and they got marched out with the Cadillac? <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Charlie Capo just got this recommend in my feed, so I figured I'd hop in and see what it's all about. Greetings all. Hope everyone. Is subscribe and like, subscribe and like. Don't miss a show. Yeah, don't Much miss more a show. Coming. Much more coming. Yeah, hi, Charlie Capo. Welcome and hit like. Well, you can hit the like at the end if you like the show, but subscribe. <laughs> you have nothing to lose. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's see. Uh Chicago Muscle, my wife will go Karen Hill on me. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> Bobby Barbarian said, hi, Chicky. Hi, buddy. <laughs> and Assassinino says his phone stinks. Hi, Wolf Cola Incorporated. Hey, yeah, Chicky and Angel, come to Boca. What about Chris? Can he come too? <laughs> uh, Assess, we push. I'd back. love to come. Yes. You what? I said I would love to come down. I gotta go. I would love to come back to Florida. I love Florida. I used to have a place in Pompano many years ago, but I I love to come back here. I love Florida. How'd you pay oh. for it with book making money? That's oh, That was a long time ago. I'm a I'm I am a uh I am a a, a, a semi uh actor now, so that's who I go by. <laughs> Chicago Muscle says, Chicky, get it done, bro. Yeah, we'll get it done. When it, we'll, uh, we'll see. I can get out of my own way right now, but someday. <laughs> uh, you can look, see, common sense said you can have a prison pen pal. <laughs> That's right. Sin Freak says, a mob tube wedding. Yeah. Uh, I am not part of mob tube. This no. Is not mob tube. I'm not even really sure what mob tube is. You know, what is it? Just a couple of people, you know, like that wish they were in the mob. I don't I don't really understand it. No, I think it's not something with mob content, but that's not even like Angel said, that's nothing to do with her. She just no, but, but I, think, I, 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 mean, I, I think it's just people that talk about mob situ mob subjects, I guess. I, I guess that's what it means. I don't even know. But but who has actually said, yeah, I'm in mob tube though? You know, I think most people are like, I don't want to be a part of it. Well, I think, I, I think, what's his name? And I, I, I think one of the guys that said it first was, M, uh, was, uh, FBS. And, you know, you know, he had, I remember that a long time ago, he had made that saying up. And I think a lot of people went with it, but I think he was one of the first ones that started saying that. Oh, look, Holly Go Lightly says she's so excited. Um, oh. yeah, that's FBS's thing. I'm not a part of Mob Tube. I don't, I, I don't have any mob content or anything like that. I don't even want to even say the word. Oh, who said that now? Holly Go Lightly says, "Look at this, Chicky. I'm wow. so excited. Well, really? <laughs> yes. Carried your books from school, playing make believe you're married to me." I'll sing to you too. 
<laughs> Any woman would be very lucky to get you, Chicky. Oh, thank you. That's right. <laughs> thank you very much. The Berg Show. Angel, how are you doing today? I'm doing very well. I hope you are as well. Uh, what's this? Ranger fan. I backed this up to the beginning. Jeff Nadeau should not be covering this genre. Genre, that's right. He is 28 and from Lancaster, Pennsylvania. He has no clue what he speaks of. Like my uncle says, if you weren't there, you don't know. Exactly. And that's why I don't talk about it because I wasn't there and I don't know. But sometimes I will go and ask. And see, that's why I feel weird like talking about like all mob guys you know, on, on YouTube or whatever because it's one thing if you've done like research or, or you you've met certain people maybe you know things like you know from like uh just from being in certain places but <laughs> to just go online start talking about complete strangers with, with no first hand information it's just, just an odd thing to me. Yeah but that's I, me, you know yeah. teacher's own. I'll tell you the truth I got I watch him and I, I know he did it recently uh uh like a three way uh, uh interview with Jeff Nato and somebody else talking about some the mob bosses or something, but I like that guy. I think he's very educated. It is um, Rogers, uh, which is name? Which how do you say? His, Jay, is RJ, RJ. RJ. Let me tell you, there's a guy that yes. uh, I got a lot. And, and you know, I said on your show a while ago about that. And he had te he texted, he actually texted me and said thank you so much. He's a gentleman, but I mean it with my heart. The guy takes a lot, a lot of uh, uh, you know, he puts his heart and soul into anything he talks about. A hundred percent. I always yeah. said that. And yeah. I don't like to, to watch and hear about any of these things. Right. I'm just not into it. Never was, never will be. Right. But I do. I respect RJ because the, the, the shows that he did do yep. um, that I watched, he put, he, listen, nobody's going to get it a hundred percent, but he no. gets close to it. Right. He, gets, he goes through the, uh, he goes through the court papers and everything. Exactly. Yeah. Like exactly. Chris, he's like you. He's a stickler with like going through everything. You don't just like you, Chris. When you say something, you're not just saying it off your ass. You I'll, uh, I'll, I'll say, you know, I don't know if it's true or not. This is, this is, you know, the information that's out there because, because they're just, uh, it's like when you just go on and you start saying something as a fact. As, yeah, as fact and stuff. And and why is it why is it true? Why because some guy said so? Exactly. Right? Like what? Because some guy said so. Or, you know, it it doesn't. Like what? <laughs> See, that's why exactly. Well, that's you know, is, when you've had lies told about you, especially by journalists who act like they're honorable people. Oh, I'm I'm preaching the truth. It's like you have just a whole different perspective on this stuff. Like, yeah, if they lied about me or my friend, you know, how do I know they're not lying about this guy? So, exactly. A hundred percent. Um, and that's RJ from Handprint Mafia. Yeah, yeah. Black, Black hand, hand. I think it's Black Handprint. Black Handprint Mafia. Right. Um, and Jerry just did the uh the intro for him. Oh, good. Yeah. Jojo the Wild Man. Chicky, did you go to Riverside Park back in the day? I used to. Yeah, yeah, I did go there. Yeah, I sure did. Now it's Six Flags. They changed it over about 20, 15 years ago, twenty years ago to Six Flags. Yeah, Riverside Park in Agawam, Massachusetts. Yep. And Chicago Muscle said, get in there. You're on Angel's dating game. Yeah, <laughs> really? uh, let's see. Holly said, I don't have Chrome. I think I need to go on Chrome. Are you on your phone, Holly, or are you on the computer? You don't need Chrome. You don't need Chrome. Just you gotta have just a uh, you just gotta have a, a link uh, like a, a computer link like you probably have. What do they call it? Like uh, internet. And then when Angel drops the little blue thing that says it's the show Angel Gotti, you press it. <laughs> and, and go ahead, tell him. Am I right? I don't know. I'm good. Yeah. Ahead. And then you press the thing and it says come on the air and you can come on. You, you know you leave the mic on or whatever and then it because it's come into the studio and then you press you know you're in the studio and then. Angel will pick up, and I'll be waiting with my hands crossed on the other side, waiting to sing to you. <laughs> Boy, Chicky, <you're> smooth. <laughs> Boston Irish says, "Chicky, you lucky." <laughs> 
That is that Casper Rose? Of course he is, because he knows the girl's coming on. He's trying to ruin it for me. Yes, what? Yes. No. <laughs> if we have anybody thirty six and younger, we have you. We have Chris Casparosi here in box yeah. number two, and has to be twenty one or over. Yeah, yeah, he likes the younger yes. one. I don't need no problems. No illegal drinking. I don't need. I don't need any problems in my life. <laughs> So we have it. Bachelor number two and Before Bachelor we speak number Hey, we phone, should do, hey, Angel, no, we, we should do right, that, man. Angel. Get a couple Bachelorettes and, like, me and Chris, and you make some questions and you're the host. It would be hilarious. Yes, I'm going to do it as soon as Holly oh, gets on. Oh, it would be so here. funny. I'm going to do it as soon as Holly gets on. <laughs> Assassinino, <laughs> Assassinino, Angel, start a new show, Angel's Dating Game. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, have have the guy that does the, the the opening for the show do the music for you. You know, dun, 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 you know the old music. Yes, Jerry. I'll let Jerry will do it. Um, Jerry, we're doing a show very very soon. That's going to be a lot of fun, Chicky. Yeah, I'm, I'm telling you for that one. <laughs> um, the Bergs, Angel. Do you know Michael Francis? Yes, I do. Anthony. Chicky, a mechanic asked when my uncle was going to pick his car up from the shop. I said, in about three to five years, no lie. <laughs> uh, common sense. No, I missed show, but I will watch the replay when it's done. But Sam Delember, how do you say his name again? Delember. Delember, yeah. Yeah. Um, great guy, really nice man, down to earth, and a gentleman all around. That's right. He really was. And Chicago Muscle says, get down, Chicky. Get down. <laughs> <laughs> and Boston says, Sam was an athletic freak. Yes. Edward said, Angel, you did a good job with interview and Sam. Thank you very much. Yeah, it, was good. it wasn't really an interview, right, Chicky? No, but it went good because it was unexpected and it just we you rolled with it and it came out really good. Stuff like that comes out better than if you plan for it. Uh yeah, but the reason why it came out good was because you were there to ask all those questions. Yeah, but we both did good. But now who's the, the gentleman that was with him? Is he your cousin, the, the, the young man? Who's that what? kid that was with him? The kid that was with him at the bar. Oh, that's that's Michael. That's my dear, very, very close friend. Oh, okay, okay. I didn't know. I didn't know if he was cousins with you or what. Okay, no, nice kid too. I just didn't know. Uh, yes, no, very, very close with Mike. <laughs> Um, I know him a long time. He's a dear friend of my cousin's. So, right. And Mike comes to New York. He comes and he stays here with me. Oh, good. Yeah. Is, is that the Mike that I met? When did you meet him? At your brother's office that time? Yes. 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 Okay. You met Mike. Yes, you did. I forgot nice about that. Yes. Very nice. Very, very nice. Um. Okay. I'm still waiting for you, Holly. <laughs> Uh, okay. Long as it isn't the bride of Chicky. <laughs> <laughs> what? Hey, Angel. Oh, Angel. Sense is the best. As long Angel, as what happens if, happen if everything gets good for me in a year from now, and then it's, everything starts working out good, and I call you in six months, I go, she put me in jail. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm fooling. Oh my god. <laughs> Leave it to common sense, the bride of Chicky. <laughs> <laughs> Hi Lou Land, how are you? Um the dating game, yeah. Yes, that's right. right. We're working on it. Lou Land says hi every hello everybody. Um Danny Stories is saying hi Chicky. What's his name? Oh, okay. How you doing, buddy? Danny, yes. <laughs> All the good people are in. Danny. Uh, Chicago Muscle says, Angel, work with me. We can get everyone a date here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, every every couple of weeks you do a dating show and you have different people from the chat in it. And you know what I'm trying to say? It would be great. 
Yeah, I know. I would love that. I always did that. So, It'd be hysterical. It'd be hysterical so, watching it too, you know? So so you're talking about like The Bachelor, but on Angel's YouTube channel, which you're just like, yeah, I, I, yeah, exactly. That's that's actually not a bad idea. It'd be a great I idea. Know, and then you, and you put the girls idea. behind a wall, like you black, you, you, you know, you put the girls where there's no picture. Or whatever you figure it out how you want to do it, it would be great. No, no, no. They, they come on the stream, but they have like uh their camera off. It's just audio. Oh, right. Yeah, that's what I mean. I think this is great, and and I get to ask the question. Yeah, you make like what what's what's uh you know ask maybe what's your favorite song of the girl and or any question you want to see if they you know, you know, what's your favorite movie. What what see if you go and you know what I mean. It's a good idea. <laughs> So chick, you don't forget to get a prenuptial. Listen, you leave the questions to me. Yeah, oh, I don't know. have one. I got. I trust an angel with the questions. I can't tell you that. Yes, and then I will figure out which one is the better match. Exactly. Yeah. Yes, and common sense says shuffleboard and wheelchairs are prerequisite. <laughs> you, you gotta, you, you angel. You gotta ask them. Okay. Uh, Female number two. Is it a deal breaker that Chicky is going away next week for eight to ten months? No, nope, she doesn't <laughs> care. Oh, Holly's uh, Holly, I'm dropping the link now. Holly was trying to find the link. I know sometimes it disappears, but the link's there now. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm gonna get to ask all these questions. If female number three, is it a deal breaker that Chicky may have to wear an ankle bracelet when he takes a bath with you in the hot tub? <laughs> no, no, listen, you're not allowed to ask those questions. Oh, I'm asking um, the best questions there are. No. Um you <laughs> Do not say things like that about our chicky. That's right, and and you know what? My phone's coming in. Like you guys are talking, like you're underwater. You're you're lucky I didn't hear that right outright, Chris. <laughs> what? Can you can you hear me clear? Yeah. Okay, I don't know what it is. It does this once in a while. When you're on, Chris, it gets like really underwatery, and then it goes away. Well, I have that effect on people. Oh, there it goes. It's going to better now. Oh, I'm so excited! I dropped the link, uh, Holly. <laughs> Holly, you know, Holly is some kind of a business where she um she works with celebrities too. Wow. Yes. If I remember. Oh, a prison wedding. Nope, nope, nope. No, I'm no, no. It ain't gonna be that long. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't gonna be that long. No prison weddings. No, we will have none of that. What if it's love at first? What if it's what if it's love at first visit? Well, well, what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> and common sense said no, Chris. That's Danny Trejo. <laughs> yeah, that's that's what I was talking about, Danny Trejo. And who was the guy? I thought that was the guy that was on Angel Mach Show. What's the guy's Machete. name on the show? <laughs> Machete. That's what they call him. Yeah, but the guy that w was uh, messaging an Angel Show in the chat, what was his name? Uh, that's somebody else. They oh, I thought it was the actor. In, I was going to say, you know him? Trio, trio. Oh, I thought it was the guy who was an actor. No, 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 no. Danny Trio is uh, Lee Cole's new partner. Oh. Uh, let's see. T.T. Rod says, I will only date a man that knows how to play bocce ball. You know how to play bocce ball? Absolutely. Oh, I've never absolutely. played before. Uh, okay. Um, Holly, grab the link at the bottom right here. I'm, I'm, pu I'm putting it again in the uh, in the comments. And press the link, and then it'll come up, and you'll see. It. You just keep following the thing. You press it to go, continue, and then it'll say you're in the studio, and boom, you're there. And then Angel will pick up. Yeah, she says, Angel, where do I find the link? I'm on Safari and don't know if I can get the link. You get the oh, link right here. Thing. Look for my comment, Holly. I swear, this is the blind leading the blind. <laughs> I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I see a fist fight coming. What's happening? Angela, Chicky, what'd you say? My she husband. Chicky is my husband. What's oh, going on? Oh, boy. <laughs> Home wrecking. <laughs> 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 and Jane says, Chicky, you better be good. <laughs> oh, yeah, Jane. Well, I say, Holly better be good. <laughs> <laughs> He's our Chicky. That's right. 
if we get married, we'd have to invite the whole chat. You get the whole chat would have to give me their inbox so they could all come. Oh my God! Please let me have the wedding on my show. Yeah, of course. <laughs> you got first the first thing. And then we'll put up the cash app for you and Holly. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody. Oh, you know what we could do? We'd have yeah, we'll have the whole wedding on your show, like and have it live, like televised live with the party and everything. That's what I just said. Yeah, oh, okay, okay. I thought you meant just and I hook up a, a cash app for you. Oh and your, boy, for you and your bride. <laughs> <laughs> My bride, she can't even figure out how to get to me. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Uncle Zio. Uncle Zio's here. Oh my God, that was so funny. I would love to do it. Oh my God, I would. Yeah. I would. I would even wear my tiara. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Holly said. Uh, Nitro. Holly said, just go into your settings on your phone from Safari and turn on your mic and camera and you can join the link from safari holly i'll keep that up on the screen if you need me to repeat it again i will hi everybody saying hi to uncle zio uncle zio wants to know what is he missing uncle zio we are fixing up chicky yeah it's well, how to go lightly yes they're going to meet right now on here because chick uh holly <laughs> proposed to chicky <laughs> so we are gonna i'm gonna ask some questions well, you know angel when what? they were cellmates they just had a really good time together so oh, oh thanks chris I mean, who had cellmates <laughs> you that's what he's trying to say that maybe in another life she knew me from another uh, like uh, who knows <laughs> <laughs> i don't understand what you hold on one second give me two seconds hold on chicky don't run out on her no, no. All right. And if you're going to do anything, just mute it. Uh, what am I? Oh, oh. Uh oh, I see somebody here. Let's see. This better not be fresh. Wait a minute. Oh, oh. Hello? Oh, I Hi. Oh, you're here. Uh, wait, am I on? I just don't. I'm not made up properly, so I don't want to We're we're looking at the ceiling. Don't worry about it. I don't want next time I'll come on with my makeup and I'll look very glamorous, but I didn't know that I could do this. Okay. Well, hide your camera. I see you have a ceiling fan on? Yes, isn't it nice? That's because I'm in Florida. All right, I see you ceiling. Who's on? Who, you, you, you got the camera? Okay. Oh, look how pretty she is. Who is Chicky, that? Your mom. Chicky, that's Don't Holly go lightly. Oh, get Holly. Get out. How are you? How are you, you gorgeous creature? You. Oh my God! Thank you. <laughs> you're you're stunning. Well, now what do you say? You on a safari? Please, I you have no idea what I just went through. I was panicking. I thought I wasn't going to get in. I went to Chrome. Now I'm on my phone. Um, and I finally got in. If I had to do it again, I wouldn't even know how to tell you the truth. That's anyway, a, plus, do you have, do you have Chicky, Instagram? Chicky, have I've been trying to propose to you for weeks now. I said, I are you kidding me? No. <laughs> I said I would wait for you, but no one was paying attention. Oh uh, well, now we uh, through Angel, we got we got here together. So I can't even believe it, you guys. Yep. I know Danny Trejo. I know Danny Trejo, the actor. You do? Yeah, because I was a casting director in California a long time, and before he was acting, we were doing a prison movie. And right. he was our technical advisor. Oh, that's what Chris was just saying. Which movie was it? it um, oh, God, it was a television movie. And you know what? It Jericho got, Mile? Is that the movie? No, no. You know what? It got, um, what do you call it? They it was with a boxing scene, right? They a boxing. They didn't let us, they didn't let us, 
the studio and the network got into a fight and they wouldn't let us make it. But we were supposed to go into a prison and Danny was going to take us as, as his tech, as a tech advisor. And I was so nervous. I said, I'm afraid if I go into the prison, they're going to go into lockdown for some reason. Something's going to happen. They're going to go into lockdown and be stuck there forever. Now, well, well. <laughs> that, that's, what, that's what happened with a small world yeah but i mean and and now danny's very successful because we, we were going to give him a small part in the movie and um he's a great guy he's a great guy I just want he's to got that him. look that everybody like and plus he's a good actor but he's got that look where he's drawn into a lot oh, of work oh my god he's got those it came in less, hey i'm right you know what i mean he's got those tattoos and I actually brought him into to audition him for something else, and I had just seen Dead Man Walking. Yeah, and just hearing the the sound Dead Man Walking freaked me out. So when he came in to meet with me, I said, "Danny, I mean, what is it like when you when you're in prison and you hear them say Dead Man Walking?" He said, "Oh, you know, everyone gets excited because you know he was we were all in the hole and we came out." out of the hole to say goodbye to him we were able to say hello how are you <laughs> so crazy. can you imagine it's like yeah yeah that's the only chance these guys got to see us because they were on death row so when they you know walked him to the you know they were walking him to the death chamber or something i don't know he said oh we were all excited to see him because we hadn't seen him because he was in the hole or something I've got so many stories, but I got to be careful because I don't want to get in trouble with <laughs> the people out there. You know what I mean? Right, right. Yeah. Um, but so when are you going and when are you coming out? And Angel, Angel, you need to come to Boca. Um, well, I'm, I'm definitely coming to Florida. Uh, uh, um It's close to Boca. It's Palm. Uh, yeah. It's, uh, that, oh, I know. Oh, it's uh, Wait, wait, it's um, Parkland, Parkland. Oh, that's right down the road. It's right Angel. down the road, exactly. Yeah. It's right down the road. I moved here, and Angel, just so you know, I moved here, oh my God, what? I had two cats, and I said, I am not moving. My daughter said, you have to take the cats. I said, absolutely, I'm taking the cats. I had to buy two seats, because I, I wouldn't put them in, in cargo, you know, so... I had to buy two seats so that they could go under the seats. So I had one empty seat just for the cat so it could go under the seat. And um, the other cat went under the seat in front of me. But these cats are so big, when I took them through security, the security person said, what are you feeding them? Steak and baked potatoes every night? <laughs> they were so big and heavy. I, I did I the same so thing. I'm sorry. Oh, go ahead. Did? I did no, the same no, did thing. I had to buy two seats for my two dogs, and I put them. Yeah. Oh, it was a nightmare. It was a nightmare. What a nightmare! And I had to sedate them because, and also to go through security, you've got to go into a private room so you could take the animal out so that they could put the their carrier through security. I mean, how crazy is that? Would I put a bomb in a? In a in a in a carrier with my babies, <laughs> I mean, but what? But you know, I blow up too. But but the the um, TSA person said when I took one out, and then the other, she looked at my cat. They're big. Hey, I, I, I got I got to run, but you guys have fun. Good night, everybody. All right, Chris. Good night, Tom. Hey, if I, Chris, I'll talk to you. But this weekend, have a good. I'll talk to you before then. But have a good uh, Greek. Greek. We'll, we'll, we'll talk okay. All right, pal. All right, brother. All right. So, Angel, would you bring all your animals? Like, all, all? Would your daughter come? Um, if uh, to move back to Florida? Yeah. Oh, you moved back? No, 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 no. I said if to move back. I'm not sure. Um, yet because I'm really not. I'm really not. Uh, too happy about leaving my grandsons. Oh. And I my know. daughter. Yeah, my daughter's like. Uh, you know, she doesn't want to leave them either. You know, I don't blame you. I understand. Yeah. I understand. I think your phone, you have a lot of static on your phone. <clears throat> I do? Yeah. 
That's because I'm on my phone. I don't know why. Let me unplug it. It's because I, I don't know. Is that better? No. See, I can hear you clearly. Really? Chicky, that's not you. Can you hear me? Right? No, I, you know, I can hear her. She's okay. She's all oh, right. Okay. All right. That's yeah. That's I mean, I don't know. Is there a way I can do this on my my computer? Because I watch you on my computer. Yes, it's better if you went on the computer. I know, but it won't let me. But my computer won't support StreamYard. Uh, oh, yeah. okay. I'm on, uh, what do you call it? Uh, Safari. And Safari won't um, support StreamYard. So it right. takes me to Chrome. I have Chrome. Yes, yeah, so you go you go to the Chrome. I know yeah, that. but part. it wouldn't let me. It was giving me such a hard time. But you know what? I'm going to practice. Oh, okay. So while you are you close to the computer while you're on your phone right now? I am. I Maybe am. that's what the static is. But I, I closed it. I closed the computer. I don't have it open. Oh, you oh don't? I want to have you showing it up. Yeah, because I, I don't know. Can everybody else hear static? No, no, no. But wait a minute. See, I see. But I didn't know that I could do Okay. Well, Hide your camera. Oh, wait a minute. Now it's repeating. Is ceiling fan on? Yeah, yeah. yeah it's because... repeating it. Oh, my God. This... <laughs> because you have to you have to close out YouTube. Oh, my God. Wait a minute. Now I've got two things going at once. <laughs> yeah, close out YouTube. And you're already on live. Okay, you know what? Uh, it was. I just opened my computer, and it was playing back. What oh, that's why. Said. Oh, so okay. shut down your computer. Shut off Angel, YouTube on your computer. I love your family. I loved your dad. And I think it's disgusting and disgraceful how they treated him in prison, a dying man. And and what did they think he was going to do that they had to tie him up? He was sick. He, I mean, I was just, just trying to break him. That's exactly. But, but that man, was he couldn't be any more broken than he was. I mean, he was dying. Yeah, but no, they didn't break him. That's the whole point. They didn't. No, no, his him. illness broke him. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, but they didn't. Uh, they didn't succeed in in anything that they tried to do to him. Maybe I don't. Right. Know, so they know. were being spiteful. And Very. Being spiteful Very. Exactly. To a dying person, not letting his family you know be with yeah. him it's just i don't understand that i don't i don't understand that on a human level I you're don't never going to understand it it's un it's it's ununderstandable you know no one i know, can understand you know that make, it's a, it really makes me mad and it frustrates me because i still want to go into that prison and yell at everybody yeah <laughs> and you know what's sickening, right? you know what's you know what's sickening too is you got you got child molesters out there that they they just give car trade you know anything get them out early you know oh, if you know. get them out eighteen months early they put them on a a, a, a bracelet on the ankle and right. uh, it's just disgusting it's absolutely disgusting you know and they and they can't be rehabilitated not at all lessons. not at all you know what I mean they, there's no not at all to, yeah they would have to cut off their you know what exactly and, and that that's what should they should have some kind of a, a law like that. Because yeah. there's there's serial molesters and serial rapists, not only just yeah. with with bad things with, with women. There's serial rapists that there's there's they they just there's no overcoming that. I don't care what they do, and you're right. They should absolutely have some kind of law where after whatever you know, they 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 do what they got to do. I mean, you know? honestly, you know, I I I think for the child molesters themselves, it must be torture because. You know, when you have that need and, you know, there was a movie, um, oh, God, that was made. Ugh. Anyway, this child molester at the end, you know, does it to himself. He, he does it to himself because he knows. He knows he'll commit again and he's tortured by it. And yep. so, you know, that was the, I can't think of the name of it, but yeah. Um, um, it's, 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 it's terrible. It's really terrible. And yeah. I, 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 I wish, you know, it's just me. I wish I could do something about it, but I really feel for your family and your mom. And, um, I think your dad would be really proud of you, Angel. I Aww, mean, thank you definitely, so much. Definitely. He would be, and I mean, honestly, he's guiding you now. Look what's happening. First of all, you have the most positive, entertaining, show on youtube yep absolutely 
you know, there's, you don't find there's, you know, if there's bickering, they get the ax immediately. And um, we love you because you're so lovable and kind and, um, you know, uh, and you have good people supporting you and you're not just talking about, you know, the mob, you're talking about life. You're right. talking about life and, and experiences and movies and songs and, you know, all that right. kind of stuff. And you're really good at which, listen, this was my job to know talent. And I'm telling you, you've got a lot of talent in this area. Oh, Holly, you're going to make me cry. You Angel, do. Angel, when I marry her, we live down in Florida. You'll feel very comfortable coming for the weekend to stay. You guys get along. Yes! <laughs> you have to and that laugh, Carol, you have, Angel, I had a girlfriend when I was a little girl, her name was Carol, and she had the same laugh as you. I wish I could find her. I don't know where she is. I don't even know if she's still alive because she was always getting into trouble, but she had that laugh, and I'm, t I'm telling you, we would, I would laugh till with her till I couldn't breathe anymore. I mean, that's, you have that laugh that's so contagious and I don't, you're just, I don't And especially when you can't catch your breath. <laughs> you, know, you, know, you know what? Thank you. But you know what? Maybe we could do a show looking for Carol. Oh, another looking good idea. Carol. Oh my God. You know something though, when she was younger, I mean, um, I was born in Jamaica States in Queens, right? Oh, and wow. You're from yeah, Queens. Yeah. And then I moved. I'm from New York. I grew up in New York. And then we moved to Forest Hills. And I would still see her. But then as she got to be a teenager, she got really rebellious. And she had to go to reform school. Oh, <laughs> and, wow. And Yeah. And she. But I still managed to see her. And, you know, um. But I don't, you know, I, you know, she, I kind of, because she was just rebellious. You know, she was adopted. So I, and her father, her adopted father, who she adored, died very young. And I think she got very rebellious. And I don't, <laughs> I don't know if she's even alive. You know, I mean, I, I, I hate to say it. I hate to say it, but. I'm yeah. sorry. I don't mean to laugh, but he's <laughs> coming. Yeah, you never know. She could be doing better than all of us. You don't know. I mean, she, she could don't be, but I mean, honestly, if I put her, if I put her and Angel in the same room, I, I don't, I don't know what would happen. The, the room would explode with those laughs. Cause she, I'm telling you. And then, you know, I used to, we used to have sleepover dates and, and, you know, when we were little and we, we would start talking and she'd start laughing and her mother would come in and said, do I have to send Leslie home? Do you want to stay here? Because you're laughing. No, we'll be good. We'll be good. We'll be quiet. And as soon as her mother left the room, we would start laughing and burying our heads in the pillow. You know? I mean, you know, there are people like that, 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 you know, you just never forget. And Angel reminds me of her with that laugh. I can't even take it. It's so uh, Thank you so much. But so um, I'm sitting here struggling with this thought. What? Um, you have two cats and right. Chicky has a big dog. So how does this work out? No, I don't uh, got a dog no more. What happened to the dog, Chicky? No, dog? the dog, no, the dog was a, the, no more dog. The dog went when that when all that stuff took place a few years ago, the dog went with a family, like a friend of our cousins, because we got all displacement, but they're our cousins. We see them all the time, but I don't I'm not with them like at my house with them physically. Oh, okay. Look. See, Holly, he got rid of the dog for you. Well, I didn't, I didn't get rid of him for Holly. You know, I can't lie. I didn't get rid of him for you, but because, you know, that would have been a hard one, but I would have done it if, you know. But you know what? I mean, Chucky. I've had lots of cats. Chucky. <laughs> I mean, Chucky. <laughs> Chucky, don't forget. No, you were thinking of Chucky bride. and Chucky's bride. That's what you are thinking of. Did you I said it before. Did I no, Jane, go right ahead. I never mind if you did that. Um, <laughs> Chicky, Wait. don't forget the old spice. Oh, I got no, oh. I'm way above that. I got oh better. Oh my stuff. god, I remember old spice. God. <laughs> 
But you know what? I had I lived in the Poconos for a while, and I had cats and dogs and bunnies, and they all got along. Oh, okay. Well, well, Chicky is dogless. Yeah, you know, that's all right. Yeah. Yep. They can get along though. It just depends. You know what I mean? Yeah. It just doesn't depends. have the dog anymore. We might have we might have to be pen pals for a couple months though, but that's okay. That's you get okay. to know each other better. That's that's okay, but I know what and you remind <laughs> me of my friend. Do you remember who Jimmy Breslin was? Yes, of course. Okay, well, I'm best friends with one of his sons. Um, oh. Chicky and Chicky sounds just like him. Chicky sounds just like, like Kevin. Chicky sounds just like Kevin. But I knew um, I knew Jimmy and I knew his wife, Rosemary, and Kevin has a twin, identical twin brother. And Kevin is like so hyper. I said, you mean there are two of you like that? You know? <laughs> I mean, but he sounds just like you. He's the sweetest guy. But his, two of his sisters died. Can you imagine? He lost two of his sisters. Oh, my God. And, I can't imagine. And, and I don't know was, what I would ever do again. Oh, it was just terrible. But you know what? I have to tell you that it's a blessing because the, the mom, Rosemary, died of cancer before the girls did. So, oh, okay, good. But yeah. Jimmy, you know, Jimmy was broken. It broke Jimmy's heart. You know, it broke Jimmy's heart. But he was a great guy. I mean, so I got, you know, it's funny because I feel I feel like a connection to you because it's just my background, you know. Um, I, I just know a lot of people and in California and New York, you know, the Poconos. So, um so Listen, what you Holly, you got to be careful here because uh, I see uh, Jennifer is trying to move in on your man. Oh, She said, Angel, you got two handsome friends. Yeah, well, she's trying to move in. Hey, Jen, lay off <laughs> <some> Holly's. <laughs> <laughs> Jen, Jen, you know, you got to hang. You, 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 that, it, that's not right. You don't move in on my man. That's <laughs> not going to happen. You know, I used to be. Uh, I have used a to be, fight over Chicky. I used to be down in the Poconos about 20 years ago. About, right, no, I'm mean, not Poconos, Pompano Beach, right? And. Uh, the Poconos I, is in Pennsylvania. Right, Pompano right. I know that. I, I made a mistake. Yeah. I meant Pompano Beach by you. But that's only yeah, like, we're, get... we're not too far from uh, Boca, from Pompano. No. No, you know, but, it's all kind of close, really. Well, Fort Lauderdale, like De La yeah. Soul and all that. They're, they're, it's only, what, 25 minutes from you? Yeah, yeah, 20 they're minutes? all very close. But yeah. I would get lost every time I got in the car because when I lived in California for so long, the ocean is on the west. west. Right, yeah. So here, the ocean is on the wrong side. Right. East. So every time I would try to go east, I would go west, and I would get so mixed up. I mean, it's taken me, I've, I've lived here about four years. I'm finally, finally figuring it out because, right. you know, it's just, I'm used to going, having to go east when I want to go uh, west. It's, <laughs> it's like, you know, I'd wind up, I don't know where I would wind up. I'd have to call one of my friends and say, I'm lost. I don't know where I am. They'd have to, I mean, they basically had to, you know, tell me how to get home. And these GPSs don't work. I'm sorry. Ange, what are you laughing? What I'm you laughing at some of the comments. Can there, you get a crazy a comment. Oh, what are they saying? Can what you get they... a date even if you are a former porn star? What? <laughs> Who's that? Yeah, wait, wait, wait a minute. See, now, Is that wait person a one? Now, wait, now I have to mute this. Oh my God! Thank you. <laughs> See, now I'm on my computer, but yeah, you're excellent. Oh, see, now she's oh, on her own. Oh, she, she's on your own computer now. Oh my God! This is okay. I finally learned my way around Florida. Now I'm gonna have to learn my way around the streamline. But I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm going to do it. You have to come on again. And 556 five, Media is, I'm actually a minister with the Universal Life Church. I can marry them. Wow. Oh, yeah. God. Okay. We're going to do it on Angel's show. 
Yeah, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna wear now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, it only has to matter from the stomach up. <laughs> what? It only has to matter from like the the stomach up. Up, to, you know what I mean? You, you know, with right. the little, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, you know, wait. On the camera. camera. I'm gonna see what this says. Allow. Try again. See, I'm there when I'm on my computer. It will only go to Chrome, and I'm so, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. We I got just, time, Angel. You know I just, Angel, yeah, because, I can I have some of the best man in the chat room too, like uh, you know, Chicago Muscle, uh, Munich. Yeah. I, I can pick out like seven, eight guys from the chat to be my best man. Um, okay, and I gotta, and I have to pick out who I'm gonna have. Well, Angel is definitely my maid of honor. Oh, there you go. Oh, you know, you're making a joke out of this. No, it could be good. It's going to be happening. Can you imagine if this really happened? Oh, my God. It's on Chickies. How did you find your husband? I found him online. Oh, hey, I'll get yeah. common sense. I'm gonna I'll go get a little psychic seven guys. Chickies, slip your version. <laughs> what is that? What? Flip your burger? What is it? A virtual arm? Yes, that would be a good idea. What? You know the virtual, you put to... the goggles on, and we could. Can... <laughs> they could say, well, if it's time to, you know, you're trying to kiss your bride, and I could kiss you virtually. Oh, my God. <laughs> No, Chickie, oh you're adorable. Oh, no, thank you. You're a sweetheart I've yourself. I've been proposing to you ever since. I can't believe it. Well, well, I'm just going to work out, Chickie. <laughs> <laughs> I promise you, I didn't know this was going to happen tonight. I had no idea. <laughs> You know, I, what do you call it? Um, we have a wedding singer in the house. <laughs> we, we did? Oh, we got, we got everybody in these rooms, chat rooms, we can get everything coming uh, forward that we need. Oh, yeah. Let's see. See, now I'm on my computer just looking at the, at the, okay. So where are you? Common sense. Where am I from? I'm on my computer looking at the. I'm reading it. <laughs> Don't oh tell me, does she God. know the sheriff? My I don't know the hurts. sheriff. No. Chicky. What is it? Oh, this is better than Netflix. <laughs> <laughs> Chicky, stand deeply uh, in the rock. <laughs> Jimmy Breslin is a great New Yorker. Yeah. Oh, okay. So people don't know. All right. My real name is uh -huh. Leslie, as you can see, because this came up on my Gmail account. Right. So, but I don't always like to post my, my real name. But... Right, right. So that's not your real name, so don't worry about it. Yeah, I mean, but you know me as Holly Golightly. Yeah. yeah. My daughter's name is Holly, and I named her after Audrey Hepburn's character in the movie. Um, <laughs> so her name is Holly, so I use Holly Golightly. We that's need the... to give... We need to give Chicky some low poetry to say. <laughs> we need to give him what? <laughs> Love poetry. Come on, Chicky. Oh, I can make up my own. Work. Oh, you like poetry? I could no. They're saying I gotta I can make my own poetry. They don't have to give me them. I can do good poetry. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Want me to give her one? Yeah. Give her a poem right now. Want me to give her some? Yeah. yeah. Good. <laughs> Roses are red, <laughs> violets are blue. It's a pleasure dating you on YouTube. <laughs> Yay! That was very good. That was very good. Now they want to know if I can cook. I can cook. Can you cook? Okay. You got, that's got to be there somewhere. I Definitely. cook. I cook everything. Oh my god! Oh, good. Here, when I'm just looking, you would make a great co-host at Angel Gotti on a dating show. Oh, yeah. You know what? We could start at first. We could do looking for Carol. I would love that, and then we could do a dating show, all of us, and we could like. Judge what do you mean, people. all of us? You're done. You hooked up with Chicky already. No, <laughs> but no, but 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 because because we're such a success, now we can set other people up. Okay. Very yeah, good. it could be in the future. 
Chicky, yeah. it's your time to shine, my man. <laughs> this is Boston. <laughs> Common I, sense says this do is you have, do you have uh, Do you have Instagram? I do. Okay, well, go on my Instagram. Uh, uh, and I, I think it's a, they kicked me out so many times, but I think the one that left is official underscore and then my name. I got to tell you something that happened to me on Instagram yesterday. This is the weirdest thing. I, I just have to tell you. A friend of my daughter's from mm -hmm. high school puts on Instagram. Now, this girl is loaded, okay? She's got a lot of money. So this is kind of strange because she puts on, oh, I just invested $2,000 and got 27000 back in three hours. Yeah. So I'm going, I'm, you know, I'm like such an idiot and I'm looking at this and I'm thinking well she's she's rich anyway so anyway so I got she put it on and so I said Steph give me your phone number I want to talk to you and she said why because <laughs> you want to make 25,000 I, I said because I want to know about this she said go to my bitcoin coach and she'll tell you Yes. So I go over to this other page and there's got, I mean, I think both these girls were hacked. Then two hours later, she posted something else. Oh, she said, what's to think about? Hurry up and do it. I'm going, what is she, nuts? Two yeah. hours later, she said, well, now I took $4,000 and I invested it and I got Fifty thousand dollars back, and here's yeah, she's Mercedes. scamming you. She's scamming you. <laughs> and here's my new Mercedes. Oh my God, my daughter started laughing. <laughs> <laughs> she's got this Merce brand new Mercedes that she ran out and bought. <laughs> it was it was between twelve and five o'clock. I'm already on the plane on my cell phone. <laughs> And I'm going, and my daughter's, my, my daughter says, mom, what is wrong with you? I said, I didn't do it. I wouldn't do it. But you know, it was, I mean, five seconds, it was pretty good. But then I decided, I, I, I thought better of it. And I said, no, but I mean, oh my God. I don't oh know. my so God, I my to, stomach hurts. I can't read these anymore. Uh, you know, I'm I mean, already, you know, I'm already in the air on the way to Boca, so I'll have to call you when I get in. <laughs> uh, Luke, are you fly, flying into Fort Lauderdale or when Yeah, I'll go uh, wherever. I, I took the fastest one available. I might land in uh, Mexico. I don't know, but I'll try to get there as soon as I can. Well, if you make it, listen, where do you live? You can get on the red eye and I'll pick you up at five in the morning. <laughs> Well, my stomach hurts. Chris was like, um, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, no all one better you, mess with my chicky. Chicky's we got to get Chris. A, we got to get Chris a date too. Like, uh, uh, like you said, Angel, thirty something, thirty something. <laughs> we can. <laughs> um, poor Chris. Yeah, he's. He needs we definitely got to get him a date. Wife. Yeah, we got to find somebody for Chris. I'm going to have somebody. I'm going to do the same thing for Chris. Well, <laughs> I tell you, I like when I heard you were going away, I I said, I'll wait for you. Oh. No, one <laughs> no one paid attention. Wow. Like ago. So I finally said, I think I have to just be pushy about it pushy yeah because i like that just be pushy and it comes right out that's the way it is and, uh, you gotta you gotta do it. i'm a new yorker at heart so yeah you know you gotta like you gotta be tough you gotta absolutely tough, you know hello but mom anyway, facts it's um, so nice to talk to you and angel absolutely oh no, uh, not so fast there holly go lightly yeah <laughs> i want to know um Will you be faithful to Chicky while he's in the pool? Okay, there we go. That's a good one. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. Will you write him? That's a least, good one. At least well, three times a week. Wow. Absolutely. Well, now, do you, is it snail mail or is it on, um, do you have internet? I think uh, from what I hear, they're giving people tablets. So if that's the case, tablets are easier. 
Then I'll send you a letter every day. Oh, but, but, but now, <clears throat> yeah. now, in order to have those tablets and to send these emails and pictures, you right. need to purchase stamps, which right. can cost up to $30 a month. Real? St wait, wait, wait. Why do I need stamps? <laughs> are, you, are you pulling my chain? No, but, but no, no, I but, am not. I would never do that. In order but that's one good thing, though. I, that part of it, I'm good. I'm good with that. If you just give me the support of a pen pal and and uh, on the on the what do they call it on the tablet, then that'll tell me about a lot you right about a lot about you right there. So well, wait, a wait a second. Wait a second. Wait. Is this going to be Core Links or is this JPay, Chicky? Is it going to be what? What? Is it Core Links or JPay? Oh. What's JPay? Is this state or federal? Oh, federal. I It'll be federal. J -date. Okay. I you said JDate. And I said, this is it. I'm not on a JDate. No, no, no. No, <laughs> so, so no this would be federal. Okay. So then you're going to be dealing with Core Links. Right. So okay. I'm not, I don't remember if you have to pay for core links, but I know JP you do. So, okay. So we already established that you will. Right. When I call her, it would come up, you know, uh, just press a button. You already got a prepaid call. Just press a, a button. Okay. So you don't even have to pay for the calls. No. Okay. No. Chicky pays for it. I pay for them. Yeah. I hope they treat you good there, Chicky. Right. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to kick in some. We're gonna have to get the. Angel's got to draw up the particulars. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, and so you you agreed to uh, be Chicky's pen pal while he's in there. Right. It sounds like you're marrying us. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is. Think of it this as like pre cana. There you go. Okay. As courting. <laughs> That's good. That's good. We're courting. We're there you courting. Go. Okay. Courting. So, I don't know. I mean, I do I have to write something down here to no. <laughs> you gotta write his address. That's what you gotta write. Yeah. You gotta we're, we're gonna we gotta figure out how you can uh, go on go on my Instagram and just uh inbox me and then we can I'll give you my uh when I get my address where I'm going, then I'll be able to send it so you can you can uh you can e you know email me or or however they do it. So what's your Instagram? My Instagram is official okay. underscore chicky c h i c k y and then my last name c e c c h e t e l l i. Wait, c e c c h e t e. Wait a minute. Let's start at the beginning. C. <laughs> I know it. All right. <laughs> uh, you want the last name? I know it's Chickatelli, right? Yeah. C E C C. Wait. C E C C. H E T E. Uh huh. L L I. Now, if you know you get married, are you going to be able to spell that name when you got to go places? <laughs> yeah. I always <laughs> wanted an Italian name. <laughs> oh, look at this. this is a match made in heaven. <laughs> now, I want to know, when our chickie gets home, right. will you be cooking meals for him? Oh, I of like course. that question. Okay. All right. What do you like? Okay. What do you like, chickie? I like I like everything, really. I like everything. Everything Italian. I like everything. I'm not a I'm not I'm very easy to please. I'm not I'm a, a good Italian a very cook. Easy. I'm a good American cook. I'm a good Chinese Perfect. cook. But I haven't made Chinese food in a long time. Yeah. Well, you got like maybe six months to practice. <laughs> you know what? I mean, since my kids grew up, but I have to tell you, my kids, my son-in-law, who passed away, unfortunately, which was tragic. But, That's too bad. Yeah, but very young. But I used to make chicken cutlets. It's like if if he knew I was making, he could smell them from like five miles away from where he. Oh my lived. God. That's incredible. And I, he would just love to come to, because my daughter doesn't really like to cook. So, right. So you know, he would come and I would make you know food for them and my granddaughter and 
she and he would be going, oh my God, this is so good. Oh my God, this is so good. And Melissa would be saying, my poor husband doesn't get a decent meal at my house. <laughs> Do you have grandchildren? Yes. Uh, how Three. many grandchildren, if you don't mind me asking? Three. Oh, God bless. All right. A I got two. And two girls. I got two. They're the best, aren't oh, they? Oh, forget it. I got a little grandson, a little granddaughter. The best. The best. It, you know what? It's like everyone should bypass being a parent and just go straight to being a grandparent. Right, because right, right. It's so much, you know, it's it just, it's like... Angel, you said, you know, you're, I was a good mother. I'm sure you're a good father, but you said your grandfather was not a good father, but he was a great grandfather to you, right? My it's, grandfather was the best grandfather in the yeah. world. Yeah. So, yeah, you know, it's because my feeling is, you know, you get to play with them and spoil them and then you can go home. <laughs> yeah. Well, <clears throat> um, um, next question. <laughs> Wait, I'm trying to. Get, I think these comments are cracking me up. I am not oh, I kidding. They're the cracking comments. me up. But I gotta look at the comments on my computer. What are they saying? Oh no, they're just so funny. Um, there better not be any girls. No, in no, life. there's nothing dirty. I, they, my people would not do that. No, no, they're not like that. No, 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 no. But they better just. Yes. Common sense says. Yeah. You know, no, oh, here we go. Common sense is on. Now he's going to. He's easy. He'll be one of the best men. Yes. Cookie. Uh, Chicky, if she can cook, might have a winner here. Yeah, she can cook. And and don't get me wrong, I love going out to dinner too. So you know, a few nights a week we'll be going out. So don't worry about that. Okay, I can cook whatever you want. I can cook <laughs> lasagna, spaghetti and meatballs. Okay. Uh, spaghetti aglio olio, spaghetti with clam sauce. As a matter oh, of fact, Chiki likes that, right, Chicky? Yes, absolutely. I like yeah. it too much. I like that stuff too much. You know, it's like, that's my, that's, um, what do you call it? Like, that's my comfort food, pasta. Yes, absolutely. You know, if I'm feeling stressed, I just whip up some, I also make carbonara. Do you know what carbonara oh, is? Oh, yes, of course. Oh, so good. Oh, yep. chicky. With a nice bolognese sauce. Forget oh, it. Chicky. Yeah. Yeah. Chicky, yeah. you're gonna go in. You're gonna lose weight. Oh, uh, forget! I come out like a I forget it. Bump forget you it. up. You know what? You know I, how you come I'm out. gonna go in to the women's side and lose some weight too. <laughs> no, because, you know because I gained ten pounds um, during COVID. I mean, there oh, was it kills everybody. It kills everybody. Oh my God! I can't even believe it. I cannot even believe it. You know why? Because I'm sitting around, sitting around. And I'm, you know, looking at YouTube, I'm watching movies. Of course, that's everybody, though. All of a sudden, I, a little image in my mind of these little pieces of pasta floating around in the <laughs> water. And I'm thinking, I got to have, it's the only thing that makes me, you know, I like other food, too, but it's just like my... What did you? You must got some favorite restaurants out in Boca area and around that area, right? For a lot of you, you know, uh, I do have some good restaurants, but there are uh, someone was saying about a <laughs> Ma Mastro Steakhouse, which is really good. Uh, but there are some good restaurants, yeah, yeah. yeah. Restaurants. Look, we got people wanting to be the flower girl here. We, we got this whole oh. show. Well, I gotta let my grandkids in. Oh, yeah, 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 that's true. Both of my grandkids have to be involved. They and the cats, <laughs> the cats will put a little ribbon around the two of them, and so yeah. he's gonna have to risk being scratched while they carry <laughs> down the yard. Uh, and we'll have the what, what's the guy, the medic, what's someone who's uh follows your show? Uh, uh, he just was on a, a, uh, the army medic, army medic, Vic. Oh, yeah, he better be there. He yeah, he'll be there. there in case somebody has a heart attack or passes out. You can revive him. <laughs> Danny yeah. Story says, I'll do code check and protect the envelopes. Uh, Danny, we're doing <laughs> cash app. <laughs> uh, Common Sense says he can do the prenup. Oh. Okay. 
Okay, we're not worried about the prenup now. <laughs> See, now I wish your father could be there because that would be the piece de resistance. Oh, yes. He probably got some good laughs anyways. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. He would be saying, what are you guys, nuts? What are you doing? You gotta go to church. Roses are red, violets are blue. I will wait eight months for you. There you go. Neil, that was funny. I love that. I'm going to frame it. And I'm going to write it. And I'm going to frame it. YouTube dating app. Look it up. It comes up under Angel Gotti. Can you imagine? I'm going to tell my friends I found the greatest dating app. And it's Angel Gotti's. Yes. Oh, there's a dating app named that? We could do that too. Oh my God. And then we No, but there's on oh search. this one. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought there was a real one. I was gonna say, are you kidding me? She's already doing this. <laughs> <laughs> I believed her. Well, don't, listen, don't knock it. I'm I'm thinking of no, it. We, no, don't knock it. I, I'm on board. Whatever you want to tell me to keep one. our minds going. <laughs> we gotta keep yeah, our yeah. Going. Lori Love is next. Yeah. Who? My cousin. My cousin. Oh, I recommend that book. To all in the chat, read Real Mob Talk. Oh, is that a book? She just recommended a book. Oh, I don't know. Um, Chicky Po. Oh, Chicky Po Allen over here. <laughs> <laughs> Chicky okay. Allen Poe. Sorry, that's okay. <laughs> we know what you meant. Uh, Chicago my- Muscle says Lori Love for the next show. Yes, definitely. Yes. I get my cousin to come on. And- I want to be on with you and Angel. Who? You. I, I, not Angel. I keep doing this. Angela. You and oh, oh, that's going to be a good, that's that'd be a good talking session. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. So, I mean, well, whatever you want is- me, I'm here because. I have to, t- can I just tell you something every single day? Because it doesn't come up on my normal warnings, like where the bell is. So every single day I check, put in Angel Gotti to see if you're going to be on. That's how I know for sure you're going to be on. Yeah, so. all you have to do is hit the notification bell and then it comes up and it tell- it sends you the notifications. Yeah, but sometimes you don't come on until late. And so I don't get the notification until just about when you're coming on. Oh, uh, well, yes. Yeah, so, like once in a while, I'll just get bored and feel like going on. And meanwhile, I always say like, oh, my God, what are we going to talk about? What can I talk about? And uh, then all of a sudden we have the best show there is. Of course, that's what it is. You know, then you I go with you, it. Yeah. We're going to be famous. You're going to be famous. Hey, you can hook up uh, Angel in another dating show. You can hook up the basketball player, too, because he has no, maybe he was going through a divorce. Oh, and he, that's right. That would be a good one. That's Who? right, but we need we need a prenup with that one. Oh, 100 percent. Oh, he That's wouldn't have it no other way. About. Yes. What's real says I bet we're not gonna see Chicky anymore. He's married now. <laughs> hey, imagine, imagine if I stop calling in and you get word to me what's going on. I say, Well, I've been dating a girl, she's not interested in me and being doing any shows. <laughs> Oh, no. Chicky, Chicky, when you go, you have to, you have, I'm going to give you the phone, my phone number and you yeah. call and we're going to set it up so that you could say hello to everyone. Absolutely. Oh, that would be the best. Oh, yes. Be the best. yes. Now, we'll wait, here's that. a, you know what, I, you know what I want to do too, Angel, I'll, uh, when I find out, cause uh, Thursday, like I said, Thursday going in, uh, it's three to four weeks to self-report. So it's three to four weeks though. I got to call every week and they let me know, okay, show up this place next week. And when I get the exact address and what place I'm going to, I'll give uh, I'll give yes. you, you can link it below. So if anybody wants to write and just say, yes. hey, you, you know, whatever, you know, whatever they want to do. Very good because it's you want to get a lot. But you know what? You don't sound like the kind of guy who belongs in prison. I no, I don't. Trust me on that. I don't. <laughs> he doesn't belong in prison. Nah, just no. a wrong place at the wrong time. That's it. Boston Irish, no, this was not planned. No. Nothing I ever do is planned. No, you just go with it. Yeah, just go with it and look how much fun. I know. I know. Well, you're going to be okay. And you're there yes, for eight absolutely. months? Yes, absolutely. You're there. You're going to be there for eight months? Yeah, well, it could be well, less. We it could be a little yet. more. I don't know for sure yet. Thursday, I'll know for sure. So it could be less, you know, it's right now it's up in the air. It's not as long, but, you know, it could be very less or it could be a little more, not not much more. All right. Listen, 
I've waited this long. I can wait a little bit Exactly, longer. exactly. Now, um, here's another poem from somebody that says, uh-oh, I lost it. Um, oh. 1113, hey, Charlie, who cares what he has to say? He's a punk. Oh, wait, let me, let me show you something. Hold on. This is for uh, a rat. Naya A. Snitch. Uh, hold on. Where is it? Oh, man, where did it go? Oh, yeah, here. You punk, you weasel. You punk, you weasel. <laughs> You guys and Juliana should be in church. Yeah. <laughs> you punk, you weasel. That's for you, <laughs> A Rat. Okay. I like the hey, I like the other. I love the other one though. Uh, you know, uh, behave yourself. No, no, I am behaving myself. You're not behaving yourself. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's get that one. Why don't you just behave yourself? I'm behaving myself. I'm not behaving myself. <laughs> I like this one. Why don't you just behave yourself? I'm behaving myself. I'm behaving myself. Uh, I miss him. <laughs> that was the reporter, right? Uh, yeah. The reporter guy. Yeah, that was John Miller. Yeah. Right, right, right. Yeah. Said, yeah, you better behave yourself. Yeah. Did you ever see? A, did you ever see a show he had that uh, he was sitting around right after your your dad got convicted? He was a young kid. That kid, he was uh, sitting around and he was talking about the whole case and everything. And he really had he, he, he talked good about your dad. And he said that Sammy was ready to flip before they even had him in the door. You know, according around, you know, with all the reporters were here. And you know what I mean? Who, Wait, hold uh, on. Let me address this. Uh, my father never called me a, a snitch or a rat or anything like that. A light is a punk. A light is a liar, and that's it. I mean, he he sits up there like a. Punk he's just a. Chicken. You uh, know what chicken. he's. You know what he is. Um, you know what I'm not losing my. All right. Uh, yeah, common sense says core links. Core um, links. You know what. A like got beat up in the street by Victor. He was left on in the street. <laughs> beat up like a bitch. Who? A light? Yeah. I'm sorry I even said that word, but that's what oh. happened. He got beat up and he was left in the street. Oh, isn't that too bad? Yeah, well. He's a fraud. He's no, he's no Where tough the guy. Where did come from? You know, Angel, way back in the beginning when he was on a show with this kid, Alex, he would talk like nonstop, like, like a rotor rooter, like, and he had no expression in his voice. And he was talking like he knew your dad, he knew this one, he knew that one, and he did work, he did that, he did the work. And I didn't know any better. You know what I mean? It was, I just thought, who is this guy? And, you know, this is kind of interesting. But then as I got to see you and all, you know, the honest content creators, I got to see what a fraud he is. Because he's got a certain amount of charm, you know, and he's not a bad looking guy. So you can get caught up in thinking that he's telling the truth. But, you know, this is, these are the kind of people who are con artists who, you know, fool people all the time. Well, he's not fooling me anymore now. Well, he's been no. exposed now. Everybody knows. Yeah, oh, of course. Now he's been exposed. Yeah. You know? Um, but in the beginning, you know, before when it was just him and Sammy and, and who else? Oh, and uh, John Francis. 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 Yeah. Michael, I don't know Michael what to Francis. make of him either. I mean, I think he's cleaned his life up and I think he's got a family and he seems like okay. You know, he doesn't seem to be bad mouthing anybody. Who? John Michael Francis. My, Michael yeah, Francis. He, I, I don't watch I, I don't watch any of these um yeah. you know, the, the these um these kind of shows. I, I have right. no interest in it, so I don't know what Michael is saying, what he's not saying. I have no idea. And I don't, I don't, don't want to know anything that those other two punks say. So I, I have zero interest in what they have to say. 
I didn't even watch his video. I learned what he said from Chicago Muscle because right. Chicago Muscle did two uh, videos on him. Otherwise, uh -huh. and if Mob Rats Exposed does uh, a show on him, then I learned, you know, from that. But other than that, I would never watch him. He's he's a liar. Yeah, Michael. No, not no, Mike. no, not Eli. Michael. Oh, Other oh, one. Sammy. Oh, Sammy. A but it's okay because in oh, the future, in the near future, Witsec Mafia is coming out and they'll explain a lot of things yeah. to a lot of people and I then nobody else wait. will be able to talk again. I can't wait because, you know, my eyes have been really open, you know, and your brother John is such a, you know, family, nice, honest guy. He's a gentleman. I mean, yeah, yeah, he is true. I got to say, gentleman. true gentleman. He's a gentleman. And you know what? When I used to watch Victoria's show years ago, I loved when you came on. I said, who's that girl? <laughs> and I I fell in love with you the mo at first sight, Angel. And I'm not bullshitting oh, you. Thank you. I was I only on, I think, three times, twice yeah, or three times. Yeah, but, you know, it doesn't, it, you know, it's, it's my job to pick up, even if someone, you know, when I used to cast uh, movies and television, I would go to the movies a lot and, and the theater a lot because I, I had to look for new talent, you know, and I wasn't looking for the movie stars because I knew the movie stars were. I was always looking for the people who had the small parts because small parts are harder to cast. So you immediately popped right out in front of me. It was like, Aww, thank girl? you. And you Todd's just... father said he can DJ and give us a photo booth. Oh, oh yeah. Over the internet. Oh, this is going to be great. <laughs> Chicky, we're going to be. Oh, this is going to be a big one. Smith could be head of security. Oh, good. Excellent. Okay. Excellent. And we bring a picture of him and put it at the head of the table. God yeah. <laughs> I um, mean, Terry said, roses are red, violets are blue. When I get out, I will fly straight. <laughs> I love that one. I saw that one. I saw that one. That's a good one. <laughs> okay, here it is. Ladies night. Single men check in with me to get on the show. That's Chicago <laughs> muscle. <laughs> Hot oh, girls and boys, 18 plus, video chat. Oh, they deleted the message. Com Common Sense says Angel was on a roll this week, putting out some great shows for the two. Thank you so much, yes. Common Sense. And least expecting it, too, just coming on. You know, that's when the best shows You come. never you know. know. You never know what's going to come on here. That's what I love about doing this. You just never know. <laughs> because it's authentic. It's authentic. Yeah, it's yeah that's exactly right. Yeah, Chicky or uh, MRE. Do you follow yeah. uh, Mob Rats Exposed, Holly? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah. MRE is great. Yeah, I know yeah. Chicky does. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's a guy. I, 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 I think I, I, I it's... called him to help me get on. I, I, I was going to say, get me MRE so I can get on here because I was panicking. I couldn't get on, but now I now don't, don't be going show to show looking to marry different ones. You already committed to me. <laughs> now you don't understand. I'm not. I'm not. A, I'm, not a, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm not. A, what they say a yo-yo. You know, you already committed to me. Don't be going on different shows now. That's it. Now listen, I <laughs> one man, woman, and okay. I, if I'm attracted to someone, that's it. Because all the people in the chat, believe me, they open up in two seconds to me. Don't be get calling me, emailing me, chicky. We saw her on another show. Uh, no, 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 no. I don't even, con I don't even comment in, on other shows unless they say something that I don't like about the right, right, right. Then I might, then I might open my mouth. But I really don't. I mean, a Angel is, you know, Angel's different. Angel's a girlfriend. You know. Wow. What I mean? She's a girlfriend. She's, yeah, no, that's good that you know she has that rapport with a lot of. That's that's good. A lot of people yeah. feel that way, comfortable. You know. And that's that's the and you know what you were you asked the right questions and yep. um <laughs> you know inquiring I, I see, what me you might get call you might get calls from the prison with me singing just me singing and even me talking I might call someday and say I got chills they're multiplying I might just call singing like that if you can handle that yeah <laughs> yeah and I'll go yeah as long as you can handle it. 
<laughs> you know what? If I had a voice, I would sing back. Actually, I'm going to oh. go because I'm tired. I don't know why. Oh, yeah. It's 11 o'clock. Yeah, Here, it's my late. voice is going. My voice is going. But listen, you guys. When are you well, thank you, thank you for coming on. Thank, thank you so much. He leaves, we're gonna get all the uh, information, and you're gonna write him and uh, wait for him. I am. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well. Okay. Now, listen, okay. When, when, when are you gonna okay. be on again, Angel? Um, I usually do it every other day, but we'll see. Maybe uh, we'll I'll, see. I'm on your Instagram, so you know my name now. So you'll see. Okay. Very good. Uh, okay. You, you can you can like join my follow me on Instagram and let me know. What is your Instagram? Oh, what is your Instagram? I what's oh the name my of God, it? It's a mess. No, it's, what is the name of it? Well, somehow I ended up with too many because yeah, I was yeah, teaching it's teaching acting, and I I had my acting teacher thing on there. But anyway, it's called the Leslie Dennis. Oh, okay. All right. So, well, um, thank you again I'm for taking the time you. to come on. What? I said thank you again for taking the time to come on. I, I it was so appreciated. Excited. I was like going crazy trying to figure this whole thing out. <laughs> I, mean, I was like, I don't understand what's going on. It's telling me to do this and it's telling me to do that. But um, tomorrow, when I'm wide awake, I'm I'm going to um, try to figure this out so I can do it on my computer. If I can see on my computer, I'm on Safari, and when the link dropped, it took me over to Chrome, and I don't I don't want to be on Chrome, and then it became very complicated. But I'm right, gonna right. figure it out. Hi, I'm Lefty. Out. <laughs> what? Now I'm talking. I'm saying hi to Lefty. Oh, okay. Lefty. Hi, Lefty. <laughs> Are you leaving, okay. Leslie? What? Are you leaving? I'm leaving, my love. I'm tired. Okay. Good night. Good night. I feel like I've been at a party. See? Why? So and I didn't even have to leave my house. I didn't have to get dressed up. See that? See, that's the thing. Angel's party. Angel Ooh, Gotti's that party. I like that. I like that. You know, Angel's got, Angel Gotti's party. I mean... Come party. No, that doesn't sound right. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. Um, that's right. He did. What that's happened? right. He did. Yeah. That's right. He did. Look, 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 look. Where is it? Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Did you block somebody? <laughs> Did you block somebody? Oh, oh no, my. no. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm just looking at this picture. Yeah. All right. I don't even know what to say. It uh, looks like shake. he's be sh shaking a bell at Christmas time with the uh, Salvation Army in a different outfit. <laughs> Uh, left lane is new to this channel, so welcome, left lane posse. Please Here subscribe and like, subscribe yeah, and like, subscribe tell your friends about like. it. About Did Angel. everybody hit the like button? Everybody hit it. You yeah. have to have liked this show. This was fun. Um, Eli, this is the, this was the happiness to the rest of my life. <laughs> so much fun. So much fun. Eli so, has as much charm as a school bus fly. <laughs> no, he's really, he, he's really, I mean, I, I don't even know what to say. I don't know what to say five, five, because six. He, he lies like, it just, you know what? He's a good actor because he can make you believe him. You know, he comes up with these stories. If you don't know better, you could believe what he's saying, except I know better. So I don't believe what he's saying. Uh, yeah, exactly. Same thing. Same Hi, Karen. Thing. All right, my darlings. I'm signing off for now, but not for All right, we'll see you. Good soon. night. Good yeah, night. Her out. Sweet dreams. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. What a chat tonight.
What? I said, what a chat to. Angel, that's my future wife. <laughs> that was oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I was wrong. Um, let's see. Let's answer some questions, Chicky. Please. Um, I don't think she knows here. how to get out. Does she know how to get out? She's stuck. Think- oh, here she's stuck in there. Oh, she is. All right, she's gone. Okay. I had to give her the kick. <laughs> I'm serious. It says kick, kick, gets out. <laughs> because she doesn't know how to get off. Right. Uh, let's see. Chicky, oh, Chicky already possessive. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 113, no one cares what that loser says. That's you go get. Go get him, Ange. <laughs> uh, are we sure? Sh- oh, that's not nice. Um, Chicky singing Grease. Yeah. It, it got me to a whole nother feeling tonight. I don't want to get into it. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Angela says, X that loser how filthy the East River was. <laughs> 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 uh the truth chicks like seinfeld said it is like a bank robbery seal the deal and get out <laughs> uh Lori love says holly said it right angel's a girlfriend absolutely ah uh, thank you and everybody said bye holly uh let's see Hi, Karen. I hope you did. Uh, and, and, oh, this is uh, between them. Okay. Mob Sax wants to know when is Chicky going? Well, Chicky goes in Thursday to find out. And yeah. Then, then it's uh, three to four weeks after that. Self report. Yeah. Okay. Um, Oh, so somebody blocked Angela? That can't be. She's no. strange Chicago. I only see him when Angel puts it up. So who who blocked you, Ange? That means somebody blocked you. Uh it's really raining bad. Is this what the what everybody was talking about? Is the nor'easter tonight? Why is it raining in, in Queens right now, uh, Angel? Uh, I'm not in Queens. I'm in Long Island. I mean, Island. sorry. I know. I mean, uh, yeah, where yeah. you are. Is it raining over yeah, there? It's raining hard. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, The tooth, Johnny Light. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Vincent Vince, Vicious says, hi, Angel, Angela, and Chicky. <laughs> that wasn't Angela up on the screen. That is uh, uh, Chicky's Holly fiance. Go lightly. That's yes. Chicky's fiance. That's- what was it? Holly go lightly, Chickatelli. Oh, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get you being a pen pal first. <laughs> yeah, let's get through uh, pen pals. <laughs> um, it might take you a really long time to read one letter. <laughs> <laughs> uh What's this? I swear he took that a page out of Scammy's book or oh, I like that name or a chapter. Too many similarities. I don't know who they're talking about. Oh, I think I have a feeling. Eli got that big size five and a half in men's shoes. <laughs> He's got a medium. <laughs> These people are so funny. They keep uh, looking at that. <laughs> Sure. He like borrowed his son's clothes when they were ten. <laughs> <laughs> you hear this? Uh, Anthony Elio said he goes, "Chicky, I would keep looking. Uh, I would keep looking. She couldn't find the link uh, at first, and and it took her four years to find the ocean floor." <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> no. Dude, oh, Six no. months, not four years. E Mob facts. A e light is a terrible actor. We had him pegged as a liar for years. No kidding. Um johnnylifefacts.com is under construction so go to witsecmafia.com in the meantime uh let's see it's raining in brooklyn it's pouring here in pa oh okay so it's on its way here probably by uh what time is it now i bet you like after two in the morning it'll be over here in new england oh really yeah like connecticut western mass will be probably after two uh, it's pouring here in Brooklyn. It was just raining here in Long Island. Yeah, it's coming. Yeah. Chicky. No, that's not nice. Um. No, that's the one that said it took her four years to find the ocean, but I don't believe that. Uh, Gravano wears small shoes and gloves, not a man, just a l small little killer. <laughs> Chicky, good luck in your new journey. Good night, Angel. Thanks for the laughs. Thank you, Boston Irish. Good night, Boston Irish. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Uh, I think that it snowed in Buffalo, did it? Yeah, it's probably out there. They do Albany up that way. They always have snow. Yeah. I swear, you go the further, um, the further you go up. Yeah. It starts snowing in August. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, I know. It's crazy. Is right. Uh, let's see. I said I said this one already. Yeah, I did. Boston Irish. Yeah. Bring in New York. Uh, Eli claims he put Greek Spyro in jail and ran Greeks out of Astoria. Yeah. Okay. I can't. I really can't. I wish John Sr. was around for the one-liners. He'd have to... Oh, forget it. That man had a way with words. Yes, he did. Okay, so Cremel has a clear night over there. But you're not in this country, Cremel. Are you? Uh, I think we're all caught up. Snow in August. My blood pressure just went up. <laughs> <laughs> I was only kidding. Oh, look at this show off. I'm in shorts and flip-flops in South Cali. My y'all. Yeah. I don't know. I, that, that'd be, who said? <laughs> he said, uh, Chicky, are you sure you're not getting ready to marry Fran Tresher? Yeah, well, I don't know yet. I got to get through the pen pal first. I don't think she sounded like Fran. No, too. I don't think so. No. Uh... Greeks made a story about a hipsters just brought up prices. Um, yeah. Little troll. Oh, oh, Cremel's in the Netherlands. 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 Yeah. Uh, they say that's beautiful out there. The yeah. Netherlands. Carol said, Eliya wishes the only thing he ran out of were the lice. <laughs> Uh, Wolf Cola Incorporated Terrific show Angel I'm going to get some shut eye though Take care guys You have a wonderful night Yeah Wolf good night Cola Incorporated So Chicky this was so much fun It was fun thank you uh, No it was thank fun again. you thank We always you. have something always comes up Whether it's a marriage proposal or the, uh, the big basketball player Or something I know so what do you think you're going to do That's it we'll, we'll just keep you uh -oh. know. Uh oh, she she's still here, Chicky. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. I hate terrible. when people call me. Oh, see, that wasn't us. I didn't it see wasn't that. Us. I didn't see that at all. No, it wasn't us. And five five six says, "Friend is hot." So is she. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. That's, chicken. that's it. That's it. Winner, winner. Wednesday night, chicken dinner in jail. When yep. Angela, <laughs> yes, Angela said, "Great, you were great, Holly." That's right, she was. Yeah. Uh, TT, Karen, Chicky, good luck. Red. Thank you. Roses are red, violets are blue. I can't believe I might marry you. <laughs> 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 and A 
Angel, a fantastic show tonight. Uh oh. She stalks you, bro. Nah, Holly's not like that. Mm-hmm. I think this will be great. I think this will be great. Chicky will have a uh, a pen pal, a future um, yeah. wife, maybe. Mm-hmm. Anything, and if anything, you'll always have a friend. Absolutely. That's that's sometimes that's more important than anything. Exactly, and you need to um, you need never you you can never forget the the person who kept you um. Uh, reading letters in prison. Oh, of course, that's huge. I mean, anybody will tell you that that I was in that situation. That's definitely something to look forward to. Exactly. Hi, Joseph. Just saw that you're alive. Not going to sleep now. Love your show even more, if that's possible. Thank you, Joseph. Um. <laughs> here, Paul says thanks, Angel and Chicky. It's been a good show. Very funny. The comments have been funny as well. Yes, they have. Thank you, Paul. Good night. And Angela says roses are red, violets are blue. I'm stuck in the middle without. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, no, Angela, you're right in the you're in right up the top with us. You're never in the middle. Yeah, exactly. She's right with us. That's right. So, Chicky, what else you wanna? Uh, you no, just uh, no, just sort of say thank you to everybody for being so nice tonight as usual. And uh, like I said, when I find out what I find out uh, Thursday, I'll definitely come on and. Uh, and when I, like I said, the most important thing, when I find out where I'm going, it'd be good. I'll, I'll get the address out and, uh, and you just go by the name and the address and you, you know, whoever wants to write, if they're bored or want to write me, it'd be appreciated, you know? Yeah. I'll, I'll put it on the banner and we'll keep yeah, it. That'd be great. Up. Yeah, yeah. That'd be great. The banner up when, uh, see like how the comment is. Yeah. Let's see if I have a banner in here. I'll show you what the banner. Oh, here, here's a banner. We can put it, we'll put it up like this. See? Oh, did I get rid of him? No, he, he, okay, but there's a banner. So we'll do that when we get Chicky's address. Oh, Steve Lawrence is on, uh, oh, on Carol Burnett. All right, everybody. Uh, Victoria is going to write. Good. Uh, Neil said he will write. And Angel, I'm leaving you, but I want to let you know I was just kidding. I like being single. No, we're going to have you next show. Don't try to get out of it. You're the next show, Lori Love. We're going to find you a boyfriend and a husband. And Kremel says, you people make it easy to have fun. That's right. You do. I have the best. I don't care what anybody, everybody always says, oh, I have the best people in my chat. No, I have the best people in my chat. Uh, my pen pal was a nurse at another facility. We're still friends years later. See, that's very nice. It's so important for, uh, for them to get letters and cards and emails. Uh, okay. I have to say one thing. I saw so many shows, like a lot of, um, you know, singers and concert and everything. Steve Lawrence and his wife, Edie Gourmet, was one of the best shows I have ever seen. And they were the opening act for Frank Sinatra. And I will never forget how great him and his wife were. And I enjoyed that more than I did Frank Sinatra. But... Everybody, I just want to thank you all. Thank you so much for coming and listening and and joining in. And thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And I'm sorry that I cursed. But I'm sorry. But good night, everyone. And thank you. And thank you, Chicky. And thank you, Holly. And thank you to all the the moderators. Thank you.